Hello, hello, hello. Oh my god, too many things. Not the thing saying die. Hello, hello, hello. How are we? We're gonna be playing some puzzle games today. How are we? Hi Chris, hi Mama, hi Sloppy. Right, we're jumping in. I don't know what this is gonna be about. Honestly, I don't know whether I'm gonna be able to do this or anything, really, but we're gonna give it a go regardless. I'm kind of excited. There's a puzzle game called Mad Experiments Escape Room. And whilst I love a good escape room, am I good at them? No. Have I ever done this before? No. You've been invited. Hi, Ozzy Duck. <clears throat> You've been invited by Professor Cheshire and his assistant Hildegard to try their new experiments on the mind. Explore and unravel the secrets of their grim mansion. Oh, we have to do chapters. Let's do chapter one first. I don't want to do relax mode. I want to be stressed. <laughs> Let's go. How are you, my darling? I wonder what this is going to be like. I don't know the controls yet. Oh my god. Oh, lobby. Try me. Ah. Halloween free mask. Which one do I want to wear? Uh, let's do the bunny. I think I have it on. Salmon. Stop examining. I guess this is what we do. Do we have to figure out how to get through here? The 60 minute timer starts when you open this door. Make sure to wait before everyone. Oh, before open. Oh, it's just. Oh, you can do this with multiple people. Interesting. This is scary. Why is it scary? Well, well, well. It looks like that you are actually my new subject. Hildegard interrupted my welcome speech, which is quite frankly indelicate, isn't it? She reminded me that I just acquired you. An unfortunate <laughs> Look at me. looking for glory. I'm just a mask. I truly hope that you have what it takes to finish it. Don't make the same mistake as the others. I'm literally just a floating mask. Alright, we have 60 minutes. 60 minutes to figure out the escape room. Okay. Oh my lucky Dead Souls by Nikolai V. What am I looking for? Oh, this is the timer. Press escape and get more hint. Oh, you can get hints. I don't want to get any hints just yet. A beautiful sailboat inside a glass bottle. How did it get there? An old gramophone. It misses a handle to work properly. So we're looking for a a handle. What the hell are these things? Tesla coil looking... Hmm... Interesting. What a strange creature, yet it feels so familiar. Does it? I don't know if it does. How do you put these like on the floor? They're just like floating. <laughs> Why are they just floating? I need a code. Beautiful gun. Why would I? Why would I need it? Why would I need this in here? What is this? 
As the two lovers look at each other, we can hear his song through the gramophone. He celebrates their burning passion and will tell you what happens next. One is one one. One, uh, one one is two ones. Twenty one is one two one. Oh my god. Hello? This is hard. If anybody has any ideas, well, feel free to let me know. I need to find a handle for this. Oh, I can go downstairs. Can I go downstairs? A door with a silver keyhole. Does that change anything? Interesting. I know, no hints. Hi, Sean. Aha. Oh. I'm looking for numbers, obviously. But what kind of numbers is the question, you know? I feel like this... Let's not have anything on it. Dead souls, no. Where is the handle for the fo Oh, what's this thing? Ah, what's... What on earth is that? Professor Cheshire speaks through this old radio. Beautiful gun. I feel like I should put everything in the middle so I know where it is, you know? on this. Hmm. I missed the handle and I walked past it. Oh, God. Oh, Sloth, will you change it back to just chatting? The only reason I had it on just chatting is because the game has, like, zero followers. <laughs> zero followers, zero views, zero everything. That's why I was just keeping on chatting. We chit chat while we play. But thank you for correcting. Oh. Is there another button that I'm missing here? Settings. Controls. Forward, back, left, right. Sprint, jump, crouch, examine, and drop. No. So it is just... So I can't... There's just nothing I can click on this yet. I just can't do anything with this, I don't think. A key! Haha! -ha! I found a key. I found a key. Oh god, don't be scary. Could this be a generator? It could be a generator, yes. It absolutely could be. It could also just be a hunk of fucking metal. Hmm. Not like a handle. Do you want me to tell- yeah, tell me where. I didn't see a handle. Was it the thing- I think it- did you, did you mean this? It's like a, a- a quill and a pen. Gold, silver... I don't think it's anything in this. I am. Podcast material back up, back up to shopping. No worries, no worries. So we're looking for something to pa power, I believe. It was in the fire. Ah. Impossible to get with this fire, so I have to turn the fire off. The only codes I have so far are the ones that are attached to that sofa. He celebrates... As the two lovers look at each other, 
We can hear his song through the gramophone. He celebrates their burning passion and we'll tell you what happens next. So the gramophone has to be first. 11, two 11 is three ones one. Oh God, this is difficult. One one is one. Two ones is 11, which means like three ones would be one one one, right? Three ones is one one one. Hmm, hello Mama Dark. Yeah, we're doing some uh, puzzle games today. If one one is one, two ones is eleven, twenty one must be two two ones. No. Fucking hell, this is difficult. Oh, this is chapter one. One of the greatest stories ever written. Alice in Wonderland. I mean, you're right. Can you not, like, open them? I wish you could open the books. I feel like... In the Garden of Dreams. can't open them, so I don't imagine there's anything in them. Okay. So how do I put this fire out? I need, I need water, right? Or like, I need a code for the fireplace. The code. Okay, so it's not. It has to be a four digit code. Funny, I've been in here 10 minutes and feel like I've accomplished nothing so far. I found the key, that was it. These Tesla coils go downstairs. I'm gonna need this. Ah, is this the vase? Is this a vase of water? One, two, four, H E R O A eight. You can tell I've never played this before, can't you? What was the point of this? I, I can't go in there, so what was the point of it opening? I don't see any signs of, like, numbers anywhere. I can jump. Electricity. A light. Light switch. Okay, I'm gonna take one hint. <laughs> Number one, keypad on the small cupboard. There are three colored bubbles above the keypad. Look in the room and see if you can find these three colors again. Keypad on the small cupboard. There are three This one. Ah, the colours. Blue, yellow, and red. Is there a number on them? Inside, possibly? No. Up against the wall. Red. And then white. Oh, there's another. Oh, there's more blue ones. 
It's more than the one. I've been looking for a number around them. Ah, uh, maybe count how many of each? That's very true. One blue. Two blue. Three blue. White. There's only one, right? That one over there. And then red. There's that red there, and there's also that red up there, so... Three... Ah, looks like an electrical device. Left click use. Downstairs. What do I use this on? Ah, ah! The generator is on. What has that changed, if anything? Does that mean I can flick the light switch on properly now? Looks like there is a power failure. Ah, the ah. lights are on. Congratulations. You have been promoted to the common intelligent being category. Just like 99% of the rest. Interesting. Good shout, chat. Good shout, good shout. I knew I could rely on you. So now, but we now need to find something for... Maybe chapter one, I'll just be nice to myself and do the clues. And then chapter two and three will be harder. Keypad on the glass cabinet for the water bottle. So I was right, that bottle is full of water. There's a clue on a paper under a box. Sometimes the tech looks a bit different. The keypad is... The case is a clue. So everywhere that we've moved... Everywhere we have moved boxes from... Ah, wait. I always have been like a box playing every day on the seashore, diverting myself now and then in finding a smoother pebble or prettier shell, while the river of truth lay undiscovered before me. Huh? Where's all the other boxes? There's nothing under this one. I'll just be that one. Yeah, I think it's just the one. I have always been like, why are the capital letters A E T? A E T R. Tia? White tear? Tia. T E A R? Okay, E A R is on there. And the white is. There was. One, right? So one. A E. One A E Okay, now maybe it's just A E R. I have always been like a boy playing every day on the seashore, diverting myself now and then in finding a smoother pebble or prettier shell, while the rhythm of truth lay undiscovered before me. Professor Cheshire. There's a white little, a white little teardrop. 1 AE. No. Um. 
Um. Oh. Oh, it spells out water. W A T E R. Right? Like while a the everyday river water that's what water I think has that got anything to do with this though in terms of the code the code's only three letters h2o period let's fucking go Yes, sir. There we go. H2O. How did I not guess H2O? I got a special power. I need a piece of fucking paper. One, two, two, one. Okay, so that's gonna be the codes for the other ones, isn't it? So I'm thinking. Where's the other thing we have to put the code into? I mean, are there any other codes? Maybe downstairs? <laughs> Thank you, Chris. I'm trying to think. I, I thought there was more places to open things, but I don't think there is. Um. Ah, this. Right. One, two, two, one. Three, one, one, two. No, not this. Something there. I think I need to like power this differently or something. This doesn't seem to be lit up yet. Next clue. Fireplace keypad. We did all that. If you look at the first part, it's 1 to 11 to 21. Count how many times there are like 1. One one two one. So, wait, I don't. Something about the fireplace still. So it count how many times there are ones. One one, two ones. Two. So that means that's two one one, right? Sorry, that's two one. No. Hmm. Count how many times... Where's the gramophone? Can I listen to it again? One day. Eleven years Eleven ago. Years ago. We I haven't done the keypad in the fireplace. One, two, one, one. And 
three one one two. So there's four four ones in total. There's four ones in total, right? Wait, one more time. <laughs> Count how many ones, I believe, is what we need to do. Okie dokie. One and a one and a two. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's nine ones in total. So, one, one, two ones. Three one ones is one two one one, right? And then three one one two must be four ones. Four one ones. Okay. So there's nine ones in total. I'm like literally writing this down. There's nine ones in total. One is one one. 11 is two ones. 21 is... Ah, so this is the difficult part, because one, two, one, one is three ones. That means it's going to be a five digit code. Hmm. Yeah, they're the numbers, but like, the code's not going to just be nine ones, is it? You know? In fact, let me have a look at how many codes there are in total in this. I'm going to assume it's like four. One, two, three, four, five, six. So the number is six digits long. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. I'm just gonna be like. Mm -hmm. That was not the right one. What was I looking at? This one. As the two lovers look at each other, we can hear his song through the ground for them. He celebrates their burning passion and will tell you what happens next. This is a really hard number. I'm not good at numbers. If you look at the first part, it's like 1, 11, 2, 1. Yeah, I got that. Count how many there are like... Two, which gives two and <clears throat> twenty-one would be one, two, one, one. So that means the last one would be three. Sorry, it would be one, three. One, one, two, one. So the code is one, three, one, one, two, one, right? Is that math? One, three, one, one, two, one. One, three, one, one, two, one. That's it. Hmm. One, two, three, one, two, one. Ah, no, wait, because that would be two ones. 
that means it would be one, three, two, one. One, two. So, one, three, two, one, one, two. Aha! Maths, baby! Oh god. Rat subject 598, name Samuel. Begin mind control experiment. And vice versa, three out of three. Ah, let's get all these in a row. Where's the other one? Four of them form two pairs, with the blue fifth in the middle, and vice versa. Oh, there's more space in here. Looks like the transfer worked. If it didn't, your head would have imploded and Hildegard would have had to clean the room. Again. Samuel's head? What the fuck is this? It's just a big square. Ah! What's that noise? It's a maze? P circles... P circle square square circle O rectangle Three of them. R O rectangle O. came in here for was that so I came this way I went that way let's go this way how do I get in there circle, just can't see the rest of it now, at the moment. And this is what we already saw, isn't it? Ah, I'm in here. Circle, circle, rectangle, circle. T is just a rectangle. S is three circles. I feel like I'm in a right maze. And then Y, I, and G. So rectangle, circle, rectangle, rectangle, 
I is circle, circle, and G is rectangle, rectangle, circle. I wanted to write all this down because my brain could never remember. Okay. Hmm. And back this way. Sound of that rat scurrying around. Is it me? Am I the rat? <laughs> Am I the rat? I feel like I've got all the letters and all the symbols. I can see. Maybe. Maybe not. That's P O R. We have that, don't we? Yeah, it's the first room. Right, let's leave. Check Samuel. Four of them form two pairs. So four of them should be the same. Oh no. And with the blue fifth in the middle. Oh my lord. Is it me? Am I the rat? Honestly. None of these are the same. So why was a rectangle, circle, rectangle, rectangle? How many of them? St well, how many of them start with a rectangle? Y, G, T, and O. How many start with a circle? I, S, S, P, R. How many start with a square? I don't think any of them do. None of them do. So two of them form pairs with the blue fifth in the middle. Do I and F form a pair? Not really. P and R? No, not at all. Well, kind of, actually. I and F, where's I? No. Two squares make a rectangle though, don't they? Yeah, there's got to be another note in there somewhere, hasn't there? There's got to be one more thing that I've missed somehow. I must have missed one. of energy. The second and third clues are behind the fireplace. You have to open it before we've done that. Keypad on the final safe. The word is found in the maze. The blinking light is one of the things to use to find the word. The final word is found here. And the blinking lights... used to help find it. That mean we're looking for the blue. So this color over here, right? At my fucking I could never with colours, but we're going back into like the pink now. Red. I feel like it's a game of hot or cold. Hmm. Y I G. be the same hmm. so 
Batman's head. Not this way. I think we have found everything that we need to find. I wonder what these things are. Wait, this is blue, isn't it? Something to do with blue. P so P.O.R. is something to do with the blue. Oh, oh. Why are these a different colour to these ones? You see, like, they're different colours. So P is all black. O is all grey. R is black, grey, black. Let me go check the other ones. I've only just realised the difference in shading. Remember, viewers, I am partially colorblind, so yeah, I do struggle to see shades of colors quite a lot. Only now realizing that the black is not a black on every single one of them. Bear with. <laughs> Bear with. Uh... How do I get back in there now? Here? I wonder how long I've got left. I doubt it's very long. Probably like 15 minutes. <clears throat> Where's the way in? There. This one I've just done, isn't it? POR. Where's the other ones? Okay, so F is black, black, grey, black. T is grey, and then S is all black. This way. So, Y, grey, black, grey, grey, all black, and then grey, grey, black, grey, grey, okay. Four of them form two pairs. Um, so what's all black? Ah, uh, okay, so I is two black zeros, well, two black O's, and P is two, two black zeros with two squares. Black, black, grey. No, so I and R. I plus R is two black zeros, so they match. And then... What other things have we got? We've got all grey rectangles. All black. Four of them form two pairs. So I feel like I and R are pairs because they're both two black zeros. Two black, yeah, two black O's. Circles, whatever. And then... We have two grey rectangles in G. We have three black black rectangles, grey rectangles in Y. Ah, so Y and G. Y and G are... No. Y and O. Y and O have three grey rectangles. That's not going to form a word, though, is it? Is that going to form a word? Surely not. I, R, Y, and Q. Ugh. 
the word is found in the maze. The blinking light is one of the things used to find the word. Secret. My daughter loves to use objects to reach random places. My daughter loves to use objects to reach random places. What is this? Ah, that's where I'm at, right? So, like, if I look like this, it leaves that there for me, if I can see. This one's a hard one. The final one to get out. What are the letters that we have all together? So we have Y, I, G, F, T, S, P, O, R. So we can have sport, uh, story, story. My daughter loves to use objects to reach random places. Wait. Wait, does that mean I can stack these boxes to reach something? What's up there? Where's the other box that's gone? To reach random places. Jump on the fucking box. Oh, I can't jump on the box. Okay. Interesting. I can't jump on the box. I can jump on the sofa, though. Is there just a light? Where else would be a random place? What is this thing? How long have we got left? 14 minutes. Oh, what the hell is this? Some ignorance name, it's obsession. I call it passion. Just like a fire, fuel it with something and it will burn forever. It could burn so strong that it could become just like us, unstoppable. What do we need to do with the gun? Do you remember the gun? What could we need this gun for? If I go in here with the gun? No. Stand on the books? I don't think we can stand on the books. Oh, we can. Just. But what do we need to stand on here? What are we going to get to? From here, you know? It's the same height as a sofa. On there. It looks like this crystal is depleted. Could it need energy? Find this room one, find the secret crystal. Who thought someone could get there? Okay, so we found a secret crystal. It needs energy. Ah, wait a second. Red, blue, and yellow. Hmm. So I can change the color of the Teslas. Can I make any of those colors? No, red, yellow. No, I can't do that either. Okay, 
Maybe this is what the notes are about. You're right, it mentioned something about blue, didn't it? Four of them are two pairs with the fifth, with the blue, with the blue fifth in the middle. Oh yeah, the little Tesla coils on the top. Four of them form two pairs. Red, red, blue, yellow, yellow. Yellow, 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 yellow. Red, 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 red. Oh, I can't. I can't change these ones, so I think this might be right. So that means upstairs must be yellow, yellow, red, red. Something's happening. Okay. Ah, and then this has the letters now. So it's five, but a word, maybe it is story. No, it's not story. What other words can we get from this? What was the clue? She likes to use... My daughter loves to use objects... Oh no, that's the thing. Keypad on the final safe. This word is found in the maze. The blinking light is one of the things used to find the word. So maybe not any, anything with all black, possibly? So that would give us... E. S. P-S-Y. P-S and Y. Gosh, this is a lot of letters. What words do you see here, gang? I see... What do I see? I see, I don't really, to be honest, I don't really see that many. First, that's a good one. Not first, not story, not sport. P, S, D, Gr, Gra, Grow, Gra ports. It's not really any clue between the um Pistol. I thought that because of the gun. Forts. Building forts. Yeah, no, good shout. Is it? I'm just trying to think what else. T for T forts. There's nothing in these clues that really give me much, I'm not gonna lie. P. Try T R I Rifts, that's a good one. Not oh, rifts. There must be something else that we're missing. There has to be. 
Well, now we've done that, actually. Is the thing downstairs available for us to see? Like this, whatever this thing is. This seems like it's important that we can't get the thing off of it. Is there any... Tesla, coil... Uh, electricity... God, we've like done so many words from this. What are the fucking words are are here? F R I. T. It's F R I R I G. R. There's got to be another clue somewhere. Rat. Subject 598. One, two, three, four, five, nine, eight. Sot. Sot. Uh... Hmm. Begin mind control experiment. We've done all of this. Another word. Maybe something will inspire us in the room. Is it possible to have the same letter twice? I've not thought about that. It is! Dots. Oh god, if it's- if you can use the same letter twice... Oh, that changes the whole game. My non subtle hint is anybody know Morse code? I have no idea about Morse code, no. I have no idea about it. Um, so. Ah, wait, so all... hold on. Four? No. One. Two. One, three. Nothing. Three. But the numbers that are like so, so maybe mm. no, surely not. No, it can't be more than five. Oh, it can. Wait, what? It's a six-letter word. Fuck. What is six letter words? Okay. 
six letters. Oh, you might have to give me a hint here, Sloppy Boy, because I actually don't know. Hmm. A blinking light, though. Like that's got to do with so that's got to do with something, right? A blinking light. Blinking light. What here screams blinking lights? You're racking your brain, so am I. I can't think of anything. To be fair, I didn't think I'd get any of this game, but I've, we've managed to do the first part not too bad, so. There's gotta be something. I don't think we've got long left. I don't know if we're gonna escape in time. We have a minute, we have two minutes. What is it? If you are... Yeah, we've done get more clues. I think it means the blinking lights in Samuel's head. fucking six out of word I can think of. Frosty. Frosty. The blinking lights is Morse code signal. That's the hint they are giving you. Oh, I don't think I have time. Devastating! Wait, I'm going back in. Don't tell me. Now we know. Now we know. I'm gonna just like go back in. Uh... Is it on? <laughs> Welcome to my house, stranger. I'm right. Like Where did we start last time? We started with the colours, so it was sure? one, two, three. Uh, Hildegard interrupted my welcome speech, which is quite frankly delicate, isn't it? She reminded me that I just acquired you, an unfortunate lost soul looking for glory. I truly hope that you have what it takes to finish it. Don't make the same mistake. Speed running it now. Not that. Um. This was H2O. Hildegard, listen to me, you lazy simple mind. It seems that if we use the positron at the exact time of death, we can measure the existence of a new entity. As if and then it was... become two different entities. <laughs> we have to double our testing rate. Like this. So, so, so close. Um, turn that on. So what's the point of the gun then? You know? Like, what was the point of the gun? I guess there isn't a point of the gun. Trivia hint was another word for phantom or ghost, but like I just don't. 
I just don't see that. Okay, so go back into the head now. So it does like it goes one one like one two three one really long really long then just like a one So we could do... Oh, so, oh. Something with them that two that are same. Ah, okay, so let's try again, so... So that's all the same. So that's three of the same. Okay. Uh uh. So maybe R. Hold on, let me go in again. Right. Three at the same speed. Short. Really long. Really long. Short. So circle, rectangle, rectangle, circle. Or circle. Or maybe P. Maybe a P. It's definitely O to begin with. Oh my god, this is so fucking hard. I can't seem to... So it seems, so the first one, duh, 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 that's like three of the same, right? Which I would assume is... Oh, I got it wrong. I think I know what it is. I think I've got it. 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 Here we are. I've got it. I kept thinking it was O, but it was S. Oh, thank God. That felt good. That felt good. Congratulations, you finished in six minutes and three seconds. Right, right, next one. Chapter two. Cheshire's experimentations injured your brain and now you're in a coma. Hildegard wants to help you to wake up by recovering your memory. <laughs> Thanks, Chris, it's all you guys helping. Spirit, for sure. God, I never thought I'd have to pick up a piece of paper to, like, write things down in a game like this, just so I can remember. Oh. Right. We are in your head, Subjects 485. Your body and soul have been separated. We need to build your spirit again by reconstructing your memory. 
will go through crucial moments in your life. These moments made you who you are. Well, who you were. Okay. Ah, puzzle. We're making a we're making a door. Oh fuck. Shit. We're making a door back into our memory. Wait. I'm out of Cheshire's reach for now, but every second that pass increases the chance that he finds us. I will try to help you along the way. God, this is crazy. This is a whole different game than the one we just played. What is that? Okay. You wanted to save me so much that you forgot everything else. Your passion turned into an obsession. It consumed you until nothing of you remained. You filled this horrendous blaze with your anger and sorrow without realizing that it was already too late. I really need to remember the order of which everything happened. Number one is a cube. Like a Rubik's cube looking thing. And we've got two, three, and four. Who can I trust? Why can't I remember? Am I losing my mind? I can't go in here. Just like our memory, this cube is not complete. A lot of cubes are missing. Okay, so we need to find some cubes. All right. Anything else around here or is it just this portal? I will never forget the day they dragged me away. I will never forget the day you locked me down in this place. I will never forget the day everything crumbled. Under the black veil, I will always find the truth. You can't go through there. Even here. It seems that a component is missing from this device. Real friends will always be there when you need them. Fountain up here. There's three of these I've now found. Letters, numbers, drawings, and symbols. Everything is connected. My father used them a lot for his studies. I need to remember this sequence. I will retrieve it step by step. So, triangle looking thing, square with a circle in the middle, thing in above. One of these, and then another square with a circle in the middle. One ball of energy is missing. Christ. <laughs> she tried to have a new glass, she said, no problem. <laughs> You're supposed to do a skate room with other people so it fits. Yeah, I like doing this with you guys. It's, it's a lot of fun. So J, K, L, and M. 
That's another thing we haven't quite done yet. H, Y, B, Alpha, Delta. Oh, Alpha, Delta, Beta, Psi, Mu. How do we get into to here? Missing an orb somewhere. Where would I find the orb though? There's one back here as well. Hi Kirsty, we're good darling, how are you? Right, let's look at the first clue. Shattered door, rotate eats, we've done that. Cube. You need to find the number of missing cubes. Did you forget to treat it as a 666 cube? Maybe you forgot to add a row. You need to find the number of missing cubes. Oh, so it's just like a... It's six by six, so I have to just count. So two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh. Oh, it's this is just the it's a total number. So, one, two, three, four, five. Six. Let me do it from down. Let me count down. I hate that I can't jump, run, and jump. It's a little bit annoying. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four. Thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, sixteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Thirty one. Thirty-one either. The one is there some missing at the back or something? Here we go. Oh, for fuck's sake. Find out how many is missing, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23? Am I just like really counting too high here? What's going on? What the fuck? What is the number? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Fuck me, I can't count, can I? Am I getting this so wrong? Nope. Hold on, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to do it like this.
33 am i able to move it no i can't pick it up bruh why can't i count one two three four five six seven eight 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. No, I need to do it the other way, don't I? That's why. I'm getting this so fucking wrong. I hate that you can't jump properly in this game, it's just my head in. I need to get like a nice angle. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So that's. First row 14, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 31. Have I put 31? I feel like this should be the easiest clue. This should be the easiest clue. Like what? Two, four? Two, five? Three, six? It is only two numbers, isn't it? Yeah, it's two numbers. It's like our memory, this cube is not complete, a lot of cubes are missing. So two here, so one, two, and then how many is it? One, two, three, this is by six. So two, six, twelve. So it is fourteen for the first row, right? And then for here, I need three plus six, so nine. Then for here, I need two plus Four, which is six. I'm only working with three rows, so it, it, it is that. Oh, I'm going too high, so is it 29? Why was I saying 31? It's not 29. The numbers they're giving is way too high, I don't get it myself. I don't understand how- it says that there's missing cubes to count the cubes. I have counted it a million times. Why can't I pick it up? I want to be able to move it. You need to find the number of missing cubes. Did you find... Did you forget to treat it as 666 cube? Maybe you forgot to add... Oh. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, okay. Now I get it. Easy. I get it. I get it. So it's... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, I think. And then that would make twelve, twenty-four, thirty-six. Okay, hold on. Fuck me. This cube. A good chunk is gone to the point where we don't even know who we are. Okay. Let's keep going. We have a handle. So much to restore. Not for this. What the hell is this handle for? Ah, uh, what's this in this tree? X, Y, Z. Yeah, I put the 42 down as well. Where the fuck does this go? What is this? It's like a little handle. It's like a steering wheel looking thing. 
Oh, I can go in here now. Okay, lovely. Um, there we go. Book. Oh, there's a red triangle. Red triangle. Circle. Red triangle. Green square. Yellow circle. This little girl seems sad. Could he be Professor Cheshire? I don't remember any of this. Who could she be? There's another one of these here. Another one of them here. Interesting. You and your friends reunited under the Black Veil. Hypnose, God of Sleep. An electricity thing to power things and such. There's a component missing from this device. Is it not this? It's not for this then. Oh. Power something else, possibly. Ah, this turns. Microscope. Random crap on there, it would seem. Unless there's something underneath it. Blue triangle. Blue triangle. Blue square. <sighs> Circle blue. It's a lot of like this, but I. Oh, do I have to paint it perhaps? Do I have to paint something somehow? I'm wondering what this is for though. Like, do you guys need this? Somebody's gonna need whatever this is. Maybe I have to use this through the portal afterwards. What this thing? Is that a green circle? Anything else? Can I open these drawers? A brain? A human brain, I guess, that Professor Cheshire studied hundreds. Red circle. Okay. Brain. 420 on the clock. <laughs> oh, 420 on the clock. Okay, so it's looking for something circular, right? So it could be... It could be you. Maybe not that one. It could be you. circular that we found you hmm 420 uh what else oh we had a yellow a yellow circle as well on something 
What was the yellow? Wait. So that was the red square, right? No, we haven't even got red square here. Red square. So that's something as well. Do you have anything on you? Red, green, yellow, red. That shape doesn't look like something we've found yet, does it? That one down there. What happens if I keep turning this? it means anything. Paintings and shapes. As a reward for completing the cube puzzle, you got a handle, insert in the round table, then look at the similarities between the paintings and the layout of the scene. First the shapes, then the colours. Look at the layout of the scene. First the shapes. And then the colours. Ah, wait. Triangle. It's triangle, isn't it? Anything else on here? Is there anything else that I need to like... Or I need to place something? On a table, perhaps? Square? Jesus. Wait, red triangle. Hold on, is this the red triangle? Right. Okay, that's the red triangle, so that must be right. Green circle is the spaceship. Yeah, so that must be right, I think. Yellow square. You're not a yellow square. Where's my yellow square? Do I have a yellow square? Anything? Have I found a yellow square? I haven't found a yellow square. What's this again? Red circle. There's a lot of things here that don't make sense. Like, what are these about? Can I move the head? I can move the head. Circle yellow. Have a look at the scene. Maybe I need to move these. Let me move these. So I can see the scene, you know? Maybe I have to figure out oh, like which way they which way they go. Looking at these. Uh, I'm two for three right right now. Well, I've got... What have I got so far? I've got a red triangle on the table. Which makes me feel like this one. Maybe like this? 
red triangle, green circle, which is that, yellow square, where would I put yellow square in between them? Where is yellow square though? I don't think I've found a yellow square, have I? That's the issue. So I don't know if that one's going to be right. Is that the red, only red triangle? It's not, no. It's this one. That looks more like it, doesn't it? Red triangle on the table, circle yellow on there, so a green square to go on here. Do I have a green square or anything? I do, it was one of the first things I picked up, so what was that? Green square, green square. So I've got blue square, red square. Is it this? Where's the, um... Triangle. You're the blue circle. What the hell did I find that was a green square? Green square, green square. I found something that was a green square. I wrote it down, so I must have found... Green square? What fucking green square thing did I- I wrote- why did I write it down if I can't even remember what it was? Um... It's not you. Not you, not you. It's not the- Not the brain. Maybe I did I leave it somewhere? Do, 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 do. Have I just put it somewhere that I can't see it? Or am I just missing it? What bottle did I find? Ah, a bottle full of chemicals. I haven't found it. Why did I why did I write down that I'd already found this? Okay, maybe I have to move this. In the corner. Right. The this is now in the corner. Does that mean I can now open this? Or this? Paintings and shapes. As a reward for completing the cube puzzle, you got it hand you got a handle. Insert it into the round table. Then look at the similarities between the paintings and the layout of the scene. First the shapes, then the colours. So have I done something wrong here? It seems like, I think this is not correct. I think this is green, so I think this should be here. It's 
So I think I'm going from this middle one, aren't I? So we've got the red triangle, which is this book here. Yeah, we have the red triangle. Oh, red triangle. And then yellow circle, which is this. Yellow circle. And then over here, green square. Which is definitely that. But it's not done anything for me, you know? Oh god, am I halfway through this already? Oh my god, I barely got anywhere. I'm confused. Surely something should have happened. Something should have happened. It's like it sh this should be in the corner. No. Wow. Oh, I just need oh, it has to be facing that way. Without the help of these drawings, you couldn't have remembered any of this. I wonder what these two people were talking about that day. The little girl seems devastated. 42. 99, so 42. 99, there are two numbers. You and your friends reunited under the black veil. You and your friends reunited under the Black Veil. Grab all this shit so I can see it all in one fucking place. To run around all the time. So, friends in stones, you need to take the component earned as a reward for completing paintings and shapes. Bring it to the black veil device. We did that. You then then you need to map provide then you need the map provided as a reward of the previous puzzle. When you enable the black veil, you can see the world with new elements and stones. Oh, so these I activate it? The screen looks a bit blurry, so maybe I did, or... Ah, but now it's functional. The device is now functional. Okay, so I'm looking for, like, the stones and stuff, right? So, S. So if I look at it, like, if I draw... Oh, fuck now. Let me draw my piece of paper. Black portal, little zone, tree, Tesla. So this stone here is S. That stone there is S. The one back here is a bear. Well, yeah, like a bear looking thing. And then. There is one here. There is... What the fuck is that? Shrimp or some shit? Shrimp looking thing. More stones. Any more stones behind here? Is like a falcon. I think. And then... Over in this part is an octopus. Any more? Uh, fish. I think that's it. So now I have all of that. 
Now I have that information there, what do I need? If you see the word in new elements, check the stones. They now have animals on them. Done that. Go behind the fountain. You should see the where the bear is. Done that. So. Oh, so do I have to use it in a? Do I have to use it in an order? Oh, I need to do. I need to have the Tesla coil on, don't I? Let's do that one first. There. Huh? I'm clicking it. There. Shrimp. Oh, there's another one as well. Another number here, 29. Right, I'm just going to have to nip to the loo. I'll be back in a sec. Hopefully it actually pauses. Give me two. All right, I'm back. Hopefully that didn't ruin our time. So am I supposed to just click? It says left click to use, and I am, but it doesn't seem to be doing anything. You see the world new element. Check the stones. They now have animals on them. Go behind the fountain. You should now see where the bear is. Compare the layout with the map. You also received as a reward three masks for four stones. Well, what would your friends do without you? Oh, so am I looking... So that's there. So eel. Like an eel, right? And then I'm going to assume it's this one. So fish. And then a bit straight behind it, which is going to be this one as we're looking at the bear, this one. So, octopus, shrimp, shrimp, octopus, shrimp, octopus. The device is now functional. Why does it only show me this? You should now see what the bear is compared to the layout. Three masks for four stones. Well, what would your friends do without you? Am I missing a different stone here? Like, how do I actually complete it? Oh, 
Letters, numbers, drawings, symbols, everything is connected. My father used them a lot for his studies. I need to remember the sequence. I will try... I'll retrieve it step by step. What's this? That's the code, isn't it? This one's much harder than the previous. There's another number there as well, 11. Nine, we've got that one. So we have to do the code for the for this, perhaps. Four, two, nine, nine, two, nine. Hmm. Not a lot of this is making sense to me, I'm not going to lie. These hints aren't very helpful either. So we've got loads of numbers. We know. We've got one, two, we've got four different numbers. 42, 99, 29, and 11. We've got all of these information things to sort of say like what letters are in certain sequences. We have a blank one over by the Tesla coil when you turn it on. All these stones have different animals on them. And we're looking to get this ball of energy. Ah, so the code is... So the first one is L. L. A square with a circle in it. Is gonna be E. Uh, the left hand side of like a, so, so we're going to say T, T, and then H L E T H E L E T H E Now where am I going to put that into though, right? L E T H We have numbers, we have letters. Now where do I put them? Where do I put the letters and the numbers? That's the question. L-E-T-H-E does not sound like anything anyway, does it? Uh, and then like eel, fish, shrimp, octopus. What are these, what do these things have in common? It doesn't feel like anything. 
you and your friends reunited under the Black Veil. The Black Veil is this thing that turns on, isn't it? Do I have to maybe click the actual animal itself? And I click to use. There's nothing to click to use. Nothing changes on the la the thing anyway. Like, I'm clicking the bear. You need to take the component earned, which is what I have right now, and bring it to the Black De Veil device. Then you need to map provided as... Then you need the map provided as a reward. When you enable the Black Veil, you see the world with new elements. Check the stones. Now they have animals on them. Go behind the fountain. You should see where the bear is. Compare the layout with the map. You also received as a reward three masks for four stones. Compare. Compare what I also received for an award. Award. Me this one. Is there just like an order I have to do this or Thing is changing. Ah, wait. Got it. Got it. I figured it out. Is the masks. So looking at the bear. Oh, bear. bear. Do these ones. So it's going to be this one. Uh, this one. That one. This one, I think. We already have the bear. So is it that one? And this one? again. It definitely is this way though, isn't it? Because like, either, it's got to be back to front because that's where the bear is. So if it's over here that the bear is, there must be one to the right of the bear. Another one. This 
we think it's not this? One, two, three. Oh, that one. Where's the other mask? Where have I put the other fucking mask? Oh, here. And then... That's got to be it, no? Is that not it? Shit. Need masks, certain masks, like, are they... Their friends be there when you need them? No, they just all say the same. One, two, three... Or one of these is wrong. Okay. Thing is, the only one that's to the left of the bear, but to the right of the bear, is this one up here, no? Is this one not right? One, two... Two... Maybe it's like this? <laughs> Bitch, which fucking way are these masks going? Oh my god. Um... Okay. See, it says it this way. Like, this is the way it gives it you. But the bear... So that would mean, if I was doing it like this, then I would have to look at it from... Like, this angle, right? So it's the bear. So then that means... Oh, that means that one mask... So one has to be... One... Oh, it's already on there. So one there. So one there, one just just down here, which we have. And then one diagonally across from there, so there. And then really far back, so not this one, but this one. powerful. Why is it getting wet? An orb. Okay. We've returned that. Eight, four, five, twelve, nineteen, twenty. As you complete Prince of Stones, an orb will appear, bring to the fountain. Under the black veil, you can see a... Uh... Right, so there's... Symbols... They're all the same, it would seem. Yeah, they're all the same. Well, next in your room, you'll have an alphabet. You can find a word. Then you need to find a link between this word and the number of the orbs. One, two, three, four, five. So there's six orbs. The word that I figured out from this past, this in the past, when it was like 10 minutes ago or whatever, it was Leth. Ethel, maybe? Ethel? Uh, 
Um, what do I do with the word though? That's it. Where do I put the word afterwards? As you complete friends and stones and all compares, bring to the fountain another black veil, you will see signs on the fountain. If you compare it with the four notes in your room, you have an alphabet. You can find a word. Then you need to find a link between this word and the number of orbs. Something's telling me I got the word wrong. Let's try this again. So the upside down triangle with nothing in it is L. The square with a circle in it, it's definitely E. Got the one of the random angles. It's definitely T. And then... It's gotta be H, right? It's gotta be H. H, E, yeah. What the fuck does that word mean? I don't know what that word means. It's your 14-year wedding anniversary today. Congratulations. Happy anniversary. Collecting's numbers, drawings, and symbols, everything is connected. My father used them a lot in his studies. I need to remember this sequence. I'll retrieve it step by step. Step by step. Uh, what happens if it's backwards? What happens if it's backwards? E H T E L. Etel. Is that right? No, that doesn't seem right either. Any clues, chat? Any clues? Anybody got any idea? Any clue? Any clue? Anybody got a clue? Anybody know? I feel like I definitely have the right word. I don't know... ...necessarily how it... One, two, three, four, five, six... Six number... Six code. Code of six. Oh, we're almost out of time as well. I have two minutes left. I have to redo this one. Hmm. <laughs> Lambda twenty. Mu eight. Psi four. Ah, wait, they change. Hold on. seem to do anything clicking them the amount of times but they have numbers Jesus this one's so hard um we're gonna run out of time so maybe we should actually just think about there was a lot of stuff there there was a lot of numbers we had 42 99 29 and 11 that showed themselves in the black veil We've definitely figured out that the code translates it 
translates to L-E-T-H-E, so it might not be necessarily a word that means anything, but it's definitely a word nonetheless that obviously equates to the code. What else do we find? Some animals on some rocks. Found all the maps, obviously, with like all of the the codes on, basically. Let's retry. All right, let's do this. Didn't watch most of this one, so I think I'll have to watch it again on the retry. No worries. Your body and soul have been separated. We need to build your spirit again by reconstructing your memory. You'll go through crucial moments in your life. These moments made you who you are. Well, who you were. <laughs> so the first puzzle is the door. Quick. I'm out of Cheshire's reach for now, but every second that pass increases the chance that he finds us. I will try to help oh. you along the way. Okay. I have to remember what we did first. So this one so the number was 65 to unlock this. That's how many we're missing. My memory is like this cube. First number 42. It's gone to the point where we don't even know who we are anymore. At the end. Let's keep going. You still have so much to restore. In there. And then with all of the things, we needed the statue on here. The mixing thing on here. And the little book. Not this book, different book. Which book was it? This one. On here. Like that. Wow. Yeah. It took you some time to solve this one. Without the help of these drawings, you couldn't have remembered any of this. Turn this on here. I wonder what these two people were talking about that day. One mask here. The girl seems devastated. One mask here. Uh, one mask over. Or is it here? And then another one. Over this side, I think. Is that right? I can't fucking remember now. It was. So the one that's we've got it, that one, that one. Yeah, so here, 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 and maybe this one, was it? No? Have I missed a step? I think I might have missed a step now. I have to do it in here, don't I? That's my issue. One that, one that, one that. I am sorry I could not stop him. He was so powerful. Take the orb. Put you back. Right, the orb's back. So now what we have to do is... We've got plenty of time. We've done all of this. So we're on the last one. Last, second to last. As you complete Friends and Stones, an orb appears. Bring it to the fountain. Under the black veil, you can see signs on the fountain. If you compare it with four notes in your room, in the room, you have an alphabet. You can find a word. Then you need to find a link between this word and the number of the orbs. So that's what it is, Chris. So alphabet-wise, we have... Let's put them over here so we can see all of them together. So we've got that one. We've got that one. 
one that's there, and then we have one more, which is... Where's the last alphabet one? Well, we compare it with the other four notes, don't we? So... Where's my other... This note, perhaps? Maybe I was missing a note. Maybe that's what it was. I've only got I've only got three plus this one. Because if I do this, so there we go. So this is our alphabet, right? A B C D H G H I J H I. Oh wait, where's J K L M J K L M? It's a four. There's another four missing. It's the clear one. Where did I put it? Where is it? Where is me naught? Where is me fucking naught? Where have I put it? I mean, it's pretty easy to see what it is anyway, because it's it's literally the same. It's this, but it's without the circles. Where have I put it, though? They're hidden, aren't they? So there's another one hidden in a tree somewhere. I found it last time, so where the fuck has it gone now? All this bloody water is so annoying. Where did I put it? Um... I have no idea where I put it. I mean, again, it doesn't really matter because we've got the rest of them, so we know it's gonna... I know that it's this without the circles in. So if you look at them all... So the first symbol is like a tent, like an up, like a triangle without the bottom to it, which makes me believe it's going to be this bottom one here, but obviously doesn't have a circle in, so it's going to be the other one. So it's H I J K L, right? J K L. So it would be L. The first letter would be L. And then the second symbol is a square, a complete square with all four sides with a circle in it, which is going to be this one here, which is E. I'm definitely going to get the right word, same word again. The third shape is like a, li a straight line and then a straight line coming down from the right hand side. So it's like this here to here. So it's T. And then the next one is a square with a circle in the middle, but without the bottom gonna be this 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 which is h and then the last one is the same as the second one which is this full square with a circle in it which is e so the word is l e t h e but that's not a word is it is that a real word like if it is what is it let me google what it means l e t h e a river in Hades whose waters cause drinkers to forget their past. So it's a river in river of Hades that causes people to forget their memory, which is what's happened to us here. We've forgot our memory, right? Now, what does that link? The word memory, what does it link to these orbs? Psi, beta, uh, beta, alpha. Delta. And they all have numbers on them as well. So, what we have, like, the information we have so far is the the word leth, or however you say it, L-E-T-H-E, we have the numbers 42, 99, 29, and 11. We have six orbs on the fountain we've got lamb lambda 
which is 20. We've got Alpha, which is... Sorry, we've got... Oh, Delta. Oh, Delta, which is 19. Delta, 19. We've got... Alpha, which is 12. We've got... Beta, which is 5. We've got... Psi, which is 4. And we've also got... Mu, which is 8. How well do I know my letters by number? Not very well. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. So L would be 12. E is five. T. Is 20. H is five, eight. Ah, wait, H and 8. There you go. There, that's a H, isn't it? H and 8. That's similar. That's something in common. So E is 5, which is the same as beta. L is 12, which is the same as alpha. T is 20, which is the same as lam lambda. H is... 8, which is the same as Mu, and E is obviously Beta again. So there's a connection now between them, right? Alpha, Beta, Candle, Mu to Beta, yeah. Alpha, Beta, Lambda, Mu, Beta. A, B, L, M, B. 12, 5, 28, 5. So they're the connections. Now, but what do we do with the connections? That's my, that's the next, that's the thing that's confusing me the most. Like, I'm glad we found that out now. If you compare it with the four notes in your room, you have an alphabet, which we've worked out. You can find a word, which we have. Then you need to find a link between this word and the numbers on the orbs. Six, by solving the puzzles, you acquired numbers. You need a date format. Date, month, year. Hmm. Two. Two. I get it. I think I've got it. I think I've got it. Because zero is not a number, so I guess we just missed the zero. Possibly. So would it be one, two, five, two, eight, five? No. I will never forget the day they dragged me away. I will never forget the day you locked me down in this place. I will never forget the day everything crumbled. Under the black veil, I will always find the truth. Have you got an idea, Chris? Yeah, this is hard, isn't it? So we have the connections. It's just, how do we make a date out of it, you know? Like, how do we make a date out of 12, 5, 28, and 5? Or... Wait a second. I'm trying to think now. If we're only looking for... It said two numbers for each, didn't it? So, like, D, D, M, M, Y, Y. So we're only looking for... Three sets of... Three, three numbers that have... Wait, wasn't there only three symbols on here? Wait, only three of them are lit up, right? One, two, three. Okay, so the first one... So it's going to be 20... Four... And 12. 24, 
12. So it's going to be Lambda, Alpha, and Psi. That can't be right, though, because we haven't used Psi, have we? So I feel like it is definitely 12, 20, and then maybe it's 4, 8, or 8, 4, possibly? No, there's no zero, which I think is honestly so silly. Why would you put a zero in if you can't use a zero? Do you know what I mean? Um... It just doesn't make sense. Well, what are the only numbers that have two? None of them. Oh, 20, 19, and 12. Right, 20, 19, and 12. So 12, 20, oh, but 20 is not, yeah, because of the zero, there's no zero. What about 12? Nineteen. No. Hey, you can't write twenty. That's so stupid. Come on, I've got to figure this out. Six orbs. Forty-two. Well, what are the other numbers? Forty-two, ninety-nine, twenty-nine, and eleven. What's the point of those? Like, I don't see why they would give us those numbers as well. So we've got 29 on there, but there's 42 there when we don't have it in the dark mode. So 29, 42. And then over in this one, when it's normal, we have 99. And then when it's dark, we have 11. So what do those numbers mean? I can't tell if that's flickering because of my game, or if it's supposed to be. You know what I mean? Oh, it's just the game. What if I interact by... but with the numbers? So if I click... So, alpha... Beta, Lambda, Mu and Beta. Ah. Last number. You fucking yes, legend. We have them all. Quick, get out of here. Dad may come back any second. Eighty seven. Okay, we have eighty seven. But she's saying come out of here, but like, we have so many fucking numbers to put in here. 49218 maybe? No? She's given us all these numbers, but we don't- we can't use them all. Um... Unless it's only the dark ones, so 42, 11, 87. Nope. 42, 29, 87. No, 99. No.
Yeah, it's a date. So we have 87, right? 11. 29. 87, 11, 29. When I click this... Oh, shit, okay. There's another one there. 59 now. So 59, 99, and 42. I know what. Do you reckon it's... Do you reckon I have to put the normal code in the normal one and the dark one in the dark one? So 59, 99, 42. 59, 99, 42. And then do the dark one at the same time. Go with the guess, yeah. Anytime, 87, 11, 29. Girl, how did you get that? He wanted to heal me and kept trying relentlessly until we passed. Go, Chris. Let's fucking go, girl. That was your win. Been restoring my memories so I can. You gotta tell me how you got it. I'm sorry, I lied to you. It was. It's a. It's literally just a date, so you guessed fair enough. I've been stuck between two worlds for so long. Oh my God, what is that? I just want to end all this. Please, allow me to reach eternal peace. Just with the numbers we had available. I guess looking at, yeah, 11 had to be the middle one. 29 had to be the first. But the last one could have been any of them, couldn't it? Like, it could have been 42, could have been 99, could have been 87, could have been 59. It could have been any of them, really. Pure luck. It could have been... Hmm. Interesting. How do I hold space to skip the sweet? Oh. Is that it? We done? Can we go back to the main menu? But all of the ones in the white place. Okay. Right, chapter three. You keep, you keep diving into the past of Hildegard. In the bedroom of her childhood, you will witness what her daily life looked like when she got into Cheshire's lab. This is the final chapter. Are we ready? Pieces of paper at the ready. <laughs> I've never wrote so much in a game in all my life. I'm kind of living for it though. It's testing my brain. Why is that plant on the ceiling? What the fuck? Oh god. The two last attempts have been a disaster. Ooh. So we are trying another treatment to stabilize Hildegard's brain frequencies. It should not take long before we calibrate our lab equipment. And we have to hurry. Oh god. No one should know what is going on here. Session 96. We have finally been rewarded for our hard work. Hildegard one digit is right and in the right place. One here. digit is right, but in the wrong place. Two digits are right, but in the wrong place. So it's definitely going to be... So we've got six and two of the numbers. All the digits are wrong. So we've got no, not seven. So there's no seven, there's no three, there's no eight. One digit is right, but in the wrong place. So it's not going to be eight, so it could be a three or a nine. So six... So looking at this, one digit is right and in the right place. One digit is right, but in the wrong place. Seven, three, and eight are all numbers that don't, you can't have. So that means that six, two, three, nine, one, and four are all numbers that are possible. Six definitely has to be one of them. Six definitely has to be one of them. One digit is right, but in the wrong place. 
So it could be three or not. No, seven, three and eight aren't right, so nine has to be correct. It's just in the wrong position. So it's two, six, nine, right? Sorry, two, nine, six. Not two, nine, six. Okay. One digit is in the right place. Oh, in the wrong place, sorry. So, 629. 692. Why did I think I was going to get that so quickly then? One digit is right and in the right place. So either six is either going to start with a six or end with a two. I think one digit is right, but in the wrong place. So it could be something six nine six two. One digit is right, but in the wrong place. Two digits are right, but they're both in the wrong place. Okay, maybe I'm not so set on six now. No worries, Chris. I think... You think it starts with nine? I think nine is the confirmed. Six, I don't think... I think six is the, 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 the throwaway. So if we start with nine, one digit is right and in the right place. So nine something... Maybe nine something two. One digit is right but in the wrong place. Nine six two nine one two nine four two nine six two nine one two nine four two nine four two okay nine four two what did that achieve for us anything BFW You wanted to save me so much that you've forgot everything else. Your passion turned into an obsession. It consumes you until you nothing of you remained. You fueled this horrendous blaze with your anger and sorrow without realizing that it was already too late. Put this on here, maybe. It's gonna be an order. Yellow, red, pink. Yellow, red, pink, green, white. So now I have to see the size of them. It's definitely going to be pink to start, I think. So pink, blue, this one, this one. One. Seems about right, doesn't it? I think, maybe? That seems right. Or is it to do with the planets? And then, so... Pink...
pink. Hmm. Interesting. What else is over here? Why would a robot carry a camera? Use that. Anything else in there? This one here. Sorry, we're coming back to lunchtime. No worries, Mama Duck. You're just in time for the final part. We're on chapter three. And we're just like, ah, there we go. So it should be green, pink, yellow. Oh, okay, so we did not do this right. So green, pink, yellow, blue, white, red, blue, white, red. Aha! We have some batteries and whatever this is. So Something in a cycle with colors. Okay. I right, say goodbye to Tom before he goes to work. Um, what's this? One code to rule them all, one code to find them, one code to bring them all, and in the darkness, bind them. So there's a string for this going up into here. Crayons. Into this. Press to start the chain reaction. Interesting. You and Mariah having sushi? Hell yeah. Owl times five minus girl times red. Gasp. This toy looks dangerous. Professor Cheshire is a curious father. We did this one, but it didn't seem to do anything for us. 942. So that's a number that we know is right for something. 942. Observatory. All these strings are attached to like these crayons. There's a number 25 on the train there as well. On the train. Anything over here? Like a couch with eyes and oh there's an oh how many owls? So one one owl two owl three owl four so one two three four owls so four times five is twenty and then the girls, I only see one. One girl. So the answer is ten, but there's no zero. So four times five is twenty minus, oh no, sorry, it's eighteen, right? Not 18. Minus what I think is 1 times 2. 2. 
but it's not 18. There must be another girl somewhere. Or another owl that I'm missing. Can I move these things? A brand new electric- oh, there's another owl there. So there's five owls, so it's 25 minus two, so the answer might be 23. Still not 23, so there's something else we're still missing. What does this say? Rod Kevin, a ramp, a, a takeoff ramp with lights turned off. The plane can't fly without the lights. Rod, Kevin, did you reinforce the takeoff ramp? Kevin, no, we didn't have time. Rod, cool. <laughs> There's another owl! Okay. Six owls, which makes 30, so the answer could be 28. The answer 28. Not 28, still missing something. Any of you guys have anything on you? Did I miss that owl before? I think I did. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's seven owls. Fucking hell. Seven, so 35. So we're talking 33, possibly? Fuck me. How many owls and shit are there? Maybe that's what that thing was. Where did that... So green and then like off, I guess? I'm guessing white or if it's not white, it might be blue. One green, the rest of them dark, and then something. Oh no, sorry. So green, pink, yellow, blue, white, red. Pink, yellow, blue, white, red. Pink, yellow, blue, oh, fuck. white. Maybe? Is that something? God, these get so much harder as you go along. Obviously the point. Batteries. What can I put batteries in? Can I put it in? Ah, shit. So it's this. Now try plus four plus three minus four plus four. Okay, so the colors mean numbers. Four. Minus six plus four. Oh God. Jesus. Anything on these? No, it doesn't look like it. What 
what is he what do I use this gun for? Not on this. This is what's got me the most confused, is this. Like, looking at this... Plus or minus green. So we have to use the thing, plus or minus. Green... Plus pink. So seven. Minus six, minus four, minus two. Seven. 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 Pink plus yellow. I imagine if it's plus or minus. Like I don't know if it, how I know which is which one's plus or minus or not. I've still not managed to figure out how many owls and things there are either. It's gotta be something. It's gotta be another one. Somewhere that I'm missing. Like a girl or an owl somewhere. What does this do? Nothing on these. Ah. We have to spell something out. I have to spell something out. Get it to go back to where it's supposed to go. Can't move these ones. What's this? Too much with this either. Hmm. What does this mean? Like, what does this do for us? It's just the distance of the planets away from the sun. any of the corners is there no I mean it said gasp there do I have to spell gasp somehow like I don't know what that's oh so I need to do something so I need to get this one right, I think. Ah, I see. So this moved backwards. This is getting stuck on this, and it can't knock the next thing over. So I need to figure this out. This is the next step. I'm almost certain I found all the owls, though. Let's let's go, like, wall by wall and stuff. So I can't have any of this. There's nothing on this specific wall itself. Over here... We've got just the one here, one owl there. We've got two because of the one here, three because of the clipboard. So three owls so far. Four up there. Five there. Six there. I'm guessing that might count as one, so seven. And then eight, possibly. So is the answer... Well, the answer 38. No, so 40, possibly. 
But if that's the not, if that's what I'm going off, then that might be two. So the answer would be four. So it will be thirty-six. Doesn't count. Doesn't count. Maybe it's thirty-eight. No. I can't find any of the women. Like there's these, like this woman. There's this big one here. Is there any more in here then? Maybe I'm... Oh, there's another fucking owl in here. So it could be 45. Five minus two, so the three. Not an owl on here or a girl on here anywhere, is there? No. So much math. I know. Well, it's it. Let me start again. So, there's the one owl in here, right? The one owl. There's nothing else in here. Just the one. One owl. Down here, one owl, one owl, two owls in because of that one in there, three, four, five, six, seven. Right? I count seven owls. So if we have seven owls times five, that's 30, 35, right? Minus however many girls there are times two, and what I'm seeing is one girl, so there's one girl, I can literally cannot find another one anywhere, which would mean that one times two is just two, so the answer would be 33, that's what I'm seeing, the answer the answer is 33, but I don't, it's not right, so then if I add these two, because these sort of like count, if they, if they count, because we can see them, would make it 40 and 4, which makes the answer 36. Which it isn't either. So I'm obviously missing an owl somewhere else, or a girl somewhere else, I guess. 8 behind the 10. Oh, I got that one. I'm sure I counted that one. Didn't I? Or even if I do 38 to try it, it's still not right. So we're missing some somewhere, is what I'm getting. Unless I can't do arithmetic, which I might be bad at now, but I'm pretty sure I can. You bet it's counting the one on the thing. So you would say eight and one. That's what you're saying. So eight times five and one times two minus each other. So you see. Ten, fifteen, twenty, nothing. But that again, that still just gives us thirty-eight, doesn't it? And we've done that one. Forty-three? It, it'd have to be an even number. It was 44. Hmm. Maybe it's less than we think? Or maybe the owl has a value. Maybe the owl has a value. Yeah, I did 38. Maybe the owl has a value that we just don't know yet. And instead of counting the owl as one for like how many of them we see, we need to figure out how much the owl's actually worth. Does that make sense? Like maybe it's actually worth something as opposed to just being valued at one. It could be like one owl is six, you know? Just all this mean. This is the one that's getting me. Chris, you might be good at this one. This one. So like you have to So 
So you see the bed. So I've started with green, and then I did like green, pink, yellow, blue, white, red, thinking that it was like the, the cycle, I guess, of like what we should have to do on top of the bed. But it didn't seem to do anything. Yeah, and or the girl has a value as well. That's obviously the next step, but we got given this as a clue, so I feel like this is something we can also use. I just don't know. The thing in the middle looks like the thing behind us, the... Uh, what's it called? The... this thing. Whatever this is. Um, I just don't... But I have to write them all down, do you think? So, like... So green. So three. Plus three. Then pink. Plus four. Plus four. Yellow. Plus four. Plus four. Blue. Minus two. Minus two. White. Minus four. Minus four. And then red. Minus six. Minus six. Can you get a look at the solar system again? Of course you can. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's ten stars. Fourteen meteors and two meteors on fire. That is one happy solar system, it is. One unaffected by our human touch of climate change, honestly. There's just gotta be I'm like obviously just missing one of these so i have to be missing but the thing is if i keep adding up and adding down then i wonder why the answer is in orange you can put a lot of numbers in here five numbers i doubt it's going to be a five though right Unless it's not adding them together and it's a code. So, like... You know what I mean? Like, maybe we don't have to actually add them together, we just have to figure out the numbers for the code itself. Have I checked the hints yet? I haven't, have I? Find numbers. The first number of the code is 9. Done that. Count the owls and girls. Look around the room, look behind objects. Also, don't forget to count them all. Sometimes we forget to count the ones that are right in front of us. Planetarium. The numbers describe a sequence where you manipulate the two previous numbers to get the next one. Writing them down somewhere for the smallest to the largest could help you figure it out. That's for the bit after. So we, the numbers we can see so far, we've, we've got a number 25 on the train. Number 73 on the plane. I feel like a butterfly. It's... Thing like a bee, flint. Any other numbers I can see? Do we need to count the owl and the girl that are pictured in the equation too? We've tried that, yeah. 
We've tried that. It doesn't say. It said it could be right in front of you. So I'm assuming now we do have to count them. So you think 41? Fucking hell, let's go, Chris. So maybe it, so it was... Oh, crazy legend. So it was nine times five and two times two. I reprogrammed this robot so I can now use it to reach people outside. Maybe I can find someone to play with. Oh. What the fuck? So now the chain reaction is here. So the ball is pushed. That pushes the digger. The digger pushes the... This stuff. Hits that. Turns it on. He goes all the way up. So now we have to close this one. So this line is attached to... This thing, I think. Yeah, so this now has numbers. Surprise yourself. I'm proud of you. Some of them I can get, but some of them I really can't. So I'm glad I have you guys with me. I love doing escape rooms with you, it's so fun. So this next one is, it said something about... So this is the keypad number three, so the planetarium. The numbers describe a sequence where you manipulate the two previous numbers to get the next one. Writing them down somewhere from the smallest to the largest could help you figure it out. Planetarium. The number describes a sequence. What numbers? The numbers, if we know what the numbers are. The numbers describe a sequence. Oh. Does it mean like 942 and then 41? So the one in the sequence would be nine four would be 901. So like 942 minus 41 is 901. No. I can move these bricks around and that's it makes me feel like I should there's something there to that. I'm trying to think what it means by the numbers in the sequence. Or does it mean these? Oh. Oh. Find the two last numbers of the solar system. Okay, so the sun. My very easy check speed of naming planets. So the sun is one. Next is Mercury. So where's Mercury at? What the fuck is Mercury? Mercury is one. Venus. Venus is two. Where's Earth? Earth is three. Mars. Mars is five. Jupiter. Jupiter is eight. Saturn is thirteen. Uranus. Jupiter 8. Sun 1. Earth 3. Mercury 1. Find the two last numbers of the solar system. So if it goes 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13. So that's like zero, that's one, that's one, that's two, five, six, seven, that's three, that's five. So would it be 20, 
and 29. There's no zero, is there? Anything change with you guys over here? Venus is to... Ah, so like the sun is in this like one bracket by itself, right? Mercury's kind of like... No. Yeah, in like the one bracket by itself. Venus shares with the moon, which is why it's two. And then maybe because Earth shares with the moon and with this asteroid, it's three. Mars is five. So it, because it shares with this asteroid, the moon, this asteroid, no, that's not good. That's not it. That's got nothing to do with it. It's the Fibonacci sequence. Love to know what the fuck that is. How do you know what that is? You're so intelligent. Fiber hoo boo. Doing the doing the what now? Sequin like a sequin sequin dress. <laughs> the fuck. Find the two last numbers of the solar system. Oh, you add the two last numbers in the sequence. So sun is one. But that would mean... Oh, the two last. Okay. So it's... So that, that would make it 21, which I tried and didn't work. Oh, is it a four code? Okay, so 21... Twenty one thirty four, so two one three four. There we go. I love you, Chris. You're so smart. You're so smart. You're so smart. Right, so that's now gone. So we can do this. Knock that over. Turn this bitch on. He's going to come up here and knock these crayons over that will go into the train eventually. Which will go into this and knock this down, knock the ball off and go into the this, right? So now we have this. One code to rule them all, one code to find them. One code to bring them all and in the darkness bind them. Look at the brand, look at the brand of the think and spell. The codes that you already have need to be bound all together in the darkness. In the darkness. Bound together in the darkness. One code to rule them all, one code to find them. What does this 25 mean? One code to bring them all in the darkness to bind them. Darkness. Be this thing. Um, look at the brand of the think and spell. The brand of the think and spell. What's that? The codes that you already have need to be bound all together in the darkness. Look at the brand of the think and spell. Oh, that, this. Look at the brand. Darkness instruments. 
Oh, there's another fucking owl on here, look. That's what we missed, I think. Darkness instruments. So bound on here. So. Nine, four, two. One, five, eight, seven, four, six. To, oh, without any light. It's the light that it needs, perhaps? Right, okay, this needs to reset, go again. Why did that not reset over here? Tower of Hanoi with coloured rings. Look around behind objects. Move that we've done that. That first. Lights on the bed. Look at the paper in the cabinet below the Tower of Hanoi. The first light is green. Then you can use the think and spell to know the next colour. Input green, then count from there. Input green and count from there. One, two, three. Input green and count from there. What the fuck does that mean? So like the that one should be green. Maybe? Yeah, I'm very confused by this one. Input green and count from there. So then, like, pink. So does that mean this one has to be pink? Or do I go from where we were? So one, two, three, so it'd be that one, actually. It's really pink. And then yellow. Plus four again, so one, two, three, four. So that one should be yellow. Maybe. And then... Minus two. Minus two. So blue should be... This one. Doesn't make any sense. And then white. Minus four, Minus four from the blue. Red. Minus six. Minus six. What? <laughs> I don't fucking know. Um. So am I counting from my... Okay, so start with... Right, green, right? Green is plus three. So start with the green and count from there. That's what it said. So... I'm counting, am I counting the green I'm on, or am I not? So green is plus three. One, two, three. Right? So the top right should be green. You would think. And then from that green, we're doing pink. So we'd go one, two, three, four. So second on the left should be pink, which it is. From that pink... Then we should do yellow, so from the stat pink, so four again, so one, two, three, four should be yellow. Is this what I tried the first time? Blue. So back two, so this would be blue, but then, yeah, because then that changes the green. 
try to count with the one I'm on. Let me just turn them all fucking white again so I can see what... Right, they're all white. Let's start this again. So, the first one's green, so I do green here, yeah? Or do I... Do I do green in this corner, or do I just go one, two, three, and that's green? So do we do the first bottom left as green, or do we do the third light bulb as green? I think we do the first one as green. Because it's green in the photo, right? So we should have that as green. Oh, you think I should count? Right, let's, let's try it with green there, and then do pink from that green, and if it doesn't work, we'll try it the other way. So Not pink would be sure. plus four, so one, two, three, four, so let's try it this way, then we'll try it the other way. Because I'm getting confused as to which ones I have and haven't done now. And then from that pink, Not we're doing sure. plus four again, so one, two, three, four, and that gives us yellow, right? And then blue, it's minus two, so back two from one, two. See, that just takes away the green, though, doesn't it? So, like, what was the point of the green in the first place? And then white, minus four from the blue, one, two, three, four. So this one has to be white, which, we, again, we've changed. Shit, which one was that? This one, wasn't it? And then minus six, so red. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this one has to be red. So that don't work. That didn't work. And that was with us starting with green as the base, right? So if we do plus three for the green this time, so if green starts there now. Plus four. Pink is four, which would make pink here. Yellow plus four. is plus four. One, two, three. Okay, that would be yellow. This one seems to be doing better. That's yellow. And blue is minus two. <laughs> Again, though. White, minus four. Yeah, it's still a problem, isn't it? Minus six. Minus six. Where did I... Fucking hell. Uh, what's yellow again? Plus four. Yellow is plus four. Pink, blue. Where's blue? Minus two. Boom, boom. That's blue, which means that one. Blue. White. Minus four. One, two, three. Four. So it's the middle one, sorry. And then from the middle minus one, I'm going minus six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So it makes this one red. Yeah, it doesn't fucking work. So it can't be those. It's not that. That's not what it's supposed to be. Three plus four is seven. Plus four is eleven. Minus two is nine. So minus one. No, that doesn't make any fucking sense either. This is a tricky one. This is a tricky one. Hmm. I don't see any other ways of, like... And that's I have to write this down. So, like... So it goes... Green... Pink... Uh, yellow... Blue... White... Red... 
clues again, please. No worries. I'm just going to nip to the loo, so have a good read. I'll be back in two. I just went to get a quick donut. <laughs> hmm. Oh, wait, look at this. Hold on. The first light is green. Okay. Then you can use it to find the next color. Input green, then count from there. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. I think I've got it. I just needed that donut to give me the energy. <laughs> so I think what we do is, um, so green and that, so pink, right? So pink is plus four from the green. So one, two, three, four. So that one's pink. And then I think rather than counting in a row like I was, you just continuously count from the green. So then yellow. Plus four. Plus four. Oh. Yellow's the same, though. Oh, that still doesn't work, does it? Hmm. Pink. I don't like how pink and yellow are both plus four. Plus four. Plus four. It's so confusing. Give this a go. Green minus two would still be this one again. So that'd be blue. It's just not right, is it? Let's look at it from this way. It's just hella confusing. Try with the others and see. What I did, so... It would be... So green, right? And then... Pink is plus four, so one, two, three, four would be pink. And then if we went from green again to the next one, yellow, it would be one, two, three, four, so it'd be yellow. Or do you want to do pink and then one, two, three, four, that's yellow. But then we go minus two, which is boom, boom, and then we end up getting with, rid of the green. But the first light has to be green. You know? Are we just making this way too complicated? Hold on. Is it white red? Okay, so it isn't that. I think that's what I started with earlier. On. What about if we do green and pink, so plus three plus four would make the second one pink. 
And then plus eight for pink and yellow. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's that one is yellow. Right. Then yellow and blue is plus two. So boom, boom. That's blue. Blue and double. Minus two and minus four is minus six. But it's not, because two minuses make a plus, right? Minus two. So I think that one needs to be red. Oh my god, why is this one so difficult? Jesus! Only able to click it. Oh, okay. Why is this so hard, though? First light is green. You can all you can use the thinking spell to know the color, the next color. Input green, then count from there. Wait, is it green? Plus three. One, two, three. Plus four. Green, yellow. Oh, hold on. Green, yellow. White. White's there. One, two, three, four. Yellow. Plus four. No, that's not going to work, is it? Is it? Green, yellow, white, yellow. White, yellow. Will you fucking light up? I swear to God. I have to know what it is. They don't give you any more cheats than this, though. What is it? Somebody fucking help. Some, somebody, one of the game devs. Give me a cheat. Hmm. Something has to light up these ramps. That's what we're looking to do. This is what we're trying to do with this. Light up the ramps. Does it give us any indication, do you think, as we change these, if we're, like, getting closer or not? I think so. I don't understand what it means by, like, adding them together. Like, f go from five and add on, you know? That's what's confusing me. Like, where are we adding on? Like, where are we start? Is it, are we going from this onwards? Are we going from the ThinkPad green? Are we... Plus three. Like, plus three, plus four is seven. Seven. Three. Oh. Like three, three plus four. four. I just, there's no plus sign, so. Maybe we can only do it in the dark? Like with the planetarium down? Or maybe it is, maybe it's this sequence here. Pink, yellow. Blue. White, red. No. I think I've tried that. That's the one that does this anyway. That thing. 
I'm just down to try anything that I might not have tried. I want to get like really close up into this. What does this plus and minus mean at the top? So there's like minus green plus. Start with green. Green plus pink. Green minus red, maybe? No? Oh, you googled? Oh, do tell. Do tell. We've been doing this for a while. I want to know. Because I'm, I'm honestly stumped. I really am. I don't think we've got that long left anyway. 17 minutes left. Is it really fucking simple as well? Is it going to piss me off? Take the batteries out and place the into the... Oh, fuck. Wait, I have. This has batteries in. I took the batteries. So I took the batteries out of here. And I put them into the thinking spell. That's how it's powered at the minute. So it has the batteries. It already has the batteries in it. I can't take the batteries out of this now. But it's got the batteries in, I promise you. Because I got them out of here. I did this by following this. And then it gave me, a, it gave me this card plus batteries. And I put the batteries into the thinking spell already. That's how it's powered. Okay, so tell me, tell me. Do tell. Doesn't make sense in your opinion. I can't see any other way of doing it. Well, figuring it out, even. Mm -hmm. Oh, you are taking the piss. So I would have to do this, so... Let me do it properly so that we can all, um... We can see it from how you're actually supposed to do it. So you start with green, and then you press green, one, so you would go one, two, three, so the next colour is blue. That's blue. Minus two. Minus two, so you go boom, boom, back to pink, so the next one's pink. This is so much easier than we were making it out to be. I feel like we just thought it was going to be harder than it is. But I always think that in escape rooms. That's probably why we get stumped. Um, so from pink, we add four. One, two, so it's red. And then from red, we minus six. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's red again. It's red again. And that would take us back to red again. So these are all going to be red. What on earth is going on here? Cookie. Now we are tall enough to open the door. My God. What are they saying? Yeah, we would we would never ever have guessed that. Like, there's so many different ways you can do it, and my my ADHD brain is always going to overcomplicate and do the absolute most. Do you know what I mean? And that was not. 
That was way too easy in my mind now. And that would have never been an option. Like I never would have I never would have thought it'd be that easy. Not at all. Not at all. Like, especially because it's like three red. Do you know what I mean? I'm assuming that we have to use like all the colours. As soon as I see six colours and six light bulbs, I'm assuming each light bulb has to be a different colour and you just have to find the right sequence. Like I would never have done like green, blue, pink, and then all red. That just doesn't I don't know. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. But we did it! We did it anyway. We've done a good job of those. Thank you, Chris, for helping. That was that was really, really, really fun. I enjoyed that. I think there's only those three. I wonder what oh, relax mode's unlimited time. There's only those three. Um let's have a look at what else we have to play, shall we? Because we've done that now. We've done a very good job of completing that. What other things did I get downloaded? Let's have a look. Because we're just going to have a fun game day of doing things we've not done before. So we have... Why is it... Um... Where are these things downloaded? Man experiments. Spirit of the Island. Should we try this one? Should we try this one? Search. Spirit. Spirit of the Island. Let's give this one a go. What's this? Play it or Revengeland? Yeah, whatever. Launch whatever. Launch however you want to launch it. I hope it's not done yet. No, 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 we're not done yet. We are not done yet. I just want to see what other games we've got now. I didn't think that was going to take as long as it did, though. I'm actually quite, I'm quite pleased with that game. For a game that was free in a bundle, and it only had three escape rooms attached to it, I'm kind of like GG on making a game that lasts like a good three, four hours, you know? Because that was, that was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed that. Now the next one, this is just another one I was looking at. I don't know what this is about. It just looks like some really cute little island shit. Let's have a look at it, shall we? This is the day, the day of us um, playing loads of new games and seeing if we like any of them or not. I don't know what this is. So this is Spirit of the Island, it says. It's giving, like, Roller Coaster Tycoon vibe. But I don't know. Quite a lot of fucking controls. God. Let's have a start. Children of the Ocean. Shall we do Children of the Ocean Legacy Story or should we do Spirit of the Island, The Secret of the Island? Should we start with the first? Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was. I love it. I love doing escape rooms with people. They're great. Whoever like coined the idea of doing escape rooms, I can't even imagine how much money they're making now, you know? Let's start with the legacy story, shall we? Oh, you can do single or multiplayer. I don't want to get any of the DLC or anything. Ooh! It's giving Toontown. It's giving Toontown. It's throwing me back. This looks so cute. It does. Right. Property name. This music's really fucking loud. Really fucking quiet now. There we go, that's better. What should we call our house? Property name. Town name, Maluhia. Region name, Mahu. Where do we want to live? What do we want to call it? Uh, let me think. Property name. Happy Duck House. Happy Duck House. HD Kingdom. That could be... The region name can be the... Happy Duck... Happy Duck... Dynasty. 
We're happy to like dynasty. We're gonna live in town name Mumble Duck Rock. <laughs> We're gonna live at Mumble Duck Rock in the Happy Duck House in the Happy Duck Dynasty. Uh, I want to be a lady. They don't look any different. That's crazy. Oh, you can pick your color. Oh my god, this is great. I love this already. Do, 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 do. What is going on with my PC? Sorry, my PC is going really weird. Right, what color do I want to be? Let's be... Why does it say white and then it gives you Caucasian? Like, I don't like that. Also, like, the ch mm, I don't like that. I don't like that that's giving Caucasian and it's white, and I don't like that that's giving, like, a black person, but it just look no, it doesn't look right. If you're going to do a skin colour, do it right. The options are crazy, but I want to do something fun. Let's be, let's be like, this bl- Let's be blue. Big D for Glamour Duck or no? <laughs> I mean, why not? Oh my god, can I like rotate you? No, I can't. What are these fucking hairstyles? They're like little little smurf people. I kinda like this little mullet thing we've got going on here. What colour hair do we want? What goes well with with like a green? I can't decide. Oh, did I? Oh, I see what you mean. I thought you meant, am I gonna give it a big dick? And then I read your comment saying, not, not that kind of dick. I just instantly went to dick and didn't want to hear anything else, obviously. Oh, cute. Oh, do we want to look bothered? Like, I feel like I want to look bothered. Oh, now it's changing the whole vibe. Hold on. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Childhood villager. Survival needs are low. Stamina recovers faster. Creatures are less aggressive. You love everything about living in a rural area and take joy in looking after your farm. Your animals mean a lot to you, while manual labour never brings you down. You know how to fend for yourself and learn to identify edible plants and gather resources all the way back in school. Foraging and exploration... I think we should go, like, villager, because I'm a bit scared to be... Oh no, this... Oh! Oh, you can choose... Wait, what the hell? You choose your childhood? Cooking is your art, and spices are your palette and brushes. You are always busy coming up with new recipes and can prepare a hearty meal from anything found on land or sea. Popular kid. As a kid, you always enjoyed the company of others and they responded in kind. Numerous adventures with friends have forged your personality. There is nothing you cannot craft or fix. You love building stuff and then destroying it in a spectacular fashion. Imagination and logical thinking made you a force to be reckoned with. You're fascinated by- this is me, baby! Fascinated by food, people, animals, challenges, and even danger. Collector. I'm a hoarder. I'm gonna be a hoarder. Let's be a hoarder. Oh, yeah. Fuck yeah. It's kind of given a combination of sadness and disgust from Inside Out. I love that for us. <laughs> I love that for us. This is cute. I love it. Oh, it's our mom and dad! That's got a stash on him. 
This looks like it's gonna be the cutest thing ever. Like, I'm so excited. Bye, Mom and Dad! We're going on an adventure. It's giving Pokemon. Hint, traders might underpay for your goods. Improve your social skills to sell items for more money. Not me getting rinsed before I've even loaded into the game. What's going on? Wait, I live. This is going to be so much fun. Am I going to get hooked on this? Imagine. Come on, let's load. I don't even know what we have to do. I guess we just like build a house and a farm and like Sims without all the craziness, but it's giving Toontown. God, I love her little pigtails. This is cute. Ah, you can build here. Oh, girl, the lag is real. You're a bit hungry. You can eat food like an apple to restore it. You can use it directly from your inventory or equip it on your hands by opening your inventory with inventory. You're a bit thirsty. Okay. Okay. There we go. We've eaten and we've drank. <laughs> Why? Why is it so cute? The boat is gone. At least I'm on the right island, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want to have fun. Let me have fun. <laughs> Where are we going? Oh, foraging. Oh, you can, like, collect red flowers and stuff. You can interact with some objects in your environment, like shake a tree, pick flowers, and more. Hey, what am I doing with all these flowers? Cut up the grass, beet seeds. It's giving, like, really cute pallia. Oh, my foraging skill has improved. How do I shake the tree? Give me what's in this tree. Oh, so this is how I get food. Okay. Farming basics. Collect dirt for the crops. How do I collect dirt? Do I get any dirt? Get a big inventory. Oh, look at all these things you get! Poison, hunger, thirst. Oh my fucking god. This is so much stuff. Look at all these things! All your skill levels. It's giving runescape. This is the island. Okay. Calendar. Diary. Relationships. Finances. Oh my god, you can balance your money and like make profits and stuff. Staff? Catalog. Quests. Your stats. Caves found. Okay, lovely. Right, did I get any dirt? Medicinal leaf. Tells you the value of things as well. Plant fibers, red flowers. Broccoli seed, beet seed, lettuce seed, cauliflower seed. Oh, look at that frog. Give me the frog. I want the frog. Why can't I get the frog? Come here. I can't get the frogs, okay. So how do I get a little patch of dirt? How do I collect dirt? This is my house, I'm assuming, for now. My little beach hut. You just saw times fainted in stats? Oh no. <laughs> Am I gonna die? So we have to go this way. Oh, current tasks in progress. Here you find your, uh, the current year, the season, the daytime, and how much coins you have. This is a small map. Quick slots. Okay. 
We want dirt though, don't we? So where are we going to collect some dirt from? Up here somewhere. Happy Duck House. As you can see, there are many places to discover. Every time you stumble across a new location, you'll gain experience for your exploration skill. There are numerous other skills to unlock and upgrade too. Give me all this stuff. I'm going to be a right good forager. Oh, you can build here. So B for build. Uh, there are required materials to build certain things. You can also move some buildings to a different place, gear near it, and press move. Some objects like crops cannot be moved until you've destroyed it, either with an axe or using a shovel. Wow. So how do I get, like, a... Seed machine, farm machine... Wooden planks... Oh god, there's so much stuff you can do. Look at this. You can get calves and little piglets and stuff. There's chickens. There's chickens. Oh my god, there's fucking chickens. I love this. Oh, I'm going to I'm literally going to be going to be obsessed with this. Girl, I'm so excited. You must be joking. How do I get a uh, wood though? I want wood. That just gives me apples. Oh, what's all this? During your journey, you may find hard environments like plants with thorns. They can hit- oh, they can hit you. Use a machete or an axe to cut it, or it will give you some resources like fat used to create oil and other items. Fat and resin. Chris, I think I've just found a new game that's going to be one that the Happy Duck family fall in love with. This must be the place. Looks messy, but at least the house is in one piece. I wonder why my parents wanted me to come here. Alright, I'm settled in. Now I should look for the elder, the one in charge of the local town. Perhaps I could use this to get started. It may be a good idea to find something to eat and drink soon, and then get some rest. Well, th let's get that letter and take a look around. I should also explore the town. This is your home. It's a bit rusty and dirty now, but in time you'll be able to upgrade it and set up new furniture. Here you can build your own farm, open up shops, and much more. Work hard, and it will become a popular tourist destination. Taking a nap is a good idea if you get tired. You already have a bed, so remember to sleep whenever you need some rest. Sleeping will also save your progress. A good night's rest may even grant you a positive buff when your energy will replenish at a faster rate for several hours. The same happens if you eat a good meal, as your health will regenerate for a while. Now, if you haven't done so already, get that wood axe, the shovel, the watering can, and the pickaxe. Those are all important tools for constructing your own buildings and getting work done. With time, you will also be able to upgrade them. So we want to get you. You. If your watering can runs out of water, you can get more from rivers and lakes, but not from the sea. A watering can is used to water crops. Later on, you may unlock other items to speed things up. Just go to a lake, equip the watering can, and use the interact button. And then there's a little chest here. Okay, how do I turn? I love... Let me just turn the tutorial off, because it's like, it's every little thing, and it's doing my bloody editing. Right, I have a little thing here. So let me, like, store my seeds. Oh, let me store all my, like, seeds and stuff. In here. And like this stuff. And you. And then in this little chest here, let me put like all of this. What's that? That's the watering can. Okay. What's in this? You need a key to unlock this one. Duct tape, glue, rope. I want to make a garden first. Like that's my big thing. I want a garden, so I've got, like, food and things, you know? So how do I make a garden? You can make aeroplanes? 5,000 coins? I don't have money for these games, and you can keep doing this to me. Let me just quickly check. Spirit of the 15 pounds. Okay, I, I thought it was free. I thought this was free. I'm not gonna lie. I didn't think this was expensive, but... That is. Farm crop. Prepares the dirt for planting seeds. So we need to get some dirt. That's what I need. How do I get dirt? Ouch. Like, what do I have to do to get some dirt? Medicinal plant, plant fiber, 
these these things keep hitting me to get rid of them all. I need to like clear up around my house, you know? So we can start building some nice things. I want to have some cute crops. It says I should find the town elder first. I wonder how many of each thing you can put in here, like as a stack. Wheat is worth a lot of money, like wheat seeds and things. Right, where's the town elder then? So farming basics, collect dirt for the crops. Where where am I gonna get dirt from? Do I have to just go up here maybe? We need to explore. Discover your origin, visit Mumbleduck Rock, and talk to the elder. Am I thirsty? Oh, who's this? Hello. It's Tony. Hey, be careful. There are some nails on the ground. I'm trying to fix a bridge and I don't know what happened. Sorry for not looking at you. If I drop this now, we may have a bigger problem. Tell you what, if you bring me some materials, maybe I can finish faster. What do you think? And then we can chat later. Okay, I will help you. As soon as I have the materials, I'll bring them to you. This is the only way to get to the town, right? Okay, I'll just see what I can do. Let's double check. I hope you can find it all. Thanks. Right, we have to find some materials for Tony. 15 wooden planks. 10 stone and 4 rope. Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to... Put that there, put that there. Oh. Shit, where did that go? Did I just drop it? Let's do that. We have to repair them as well. Um, move you there. Knife, dirt, dirt, shovel, hammer. How do I get rid of this one? Shovel, hammer, how many is that? One, two, three, four, five. That's all of those. And then I want water food as well and then i need the axe to be able to cut down the trees i'm gonna assume yeah and you have to fix all your items there's some wood lovely gorgeous I'm just... Oh, may maybe I get dirt from using the shovel. Yes, I do. I get dirt and worms. I need to get some stone as well. Right, so I have enough dirt to make a little... A little, a little garden, I think. Farm crop. There we go. I need seeds before I can plant here. What should we plant? Let's plant some potatoes. Plant some potatoes. Oh yeah, baby. And then I'm assuming we need to... Oh shit, I need to add watering can. Six. There we go. And I guess I just let it start to grow. Wooden plank. Do I make planks in here? I do. Oh, I 
have to wait for it to do it. Okay. So I have to wait for that. Can I get... Yes, I can get stuff from here from mining. I think your, your equipment replenishes over time as well. That's good. 21 stone. I need duct tape as well. Not finished yet. Lots of more chests. Go, can you? Okay. So I need to clear out all this space. I'm gonna have like a little garden area, a little like building area. We have to attract tourists as well, somehow. Um, can I, oh, I, can I get rid of these? Yeah, let me get rid of these fences, because they're shit. Make some better ones. Oh, my bag's full. Um, uh, what do I want to put away? Stone. Just everything, don't I, really? For now. And then we'll grab what we need to grab afterwards. Worms. I think you can fish in this as well. Wheat seeds seem to sell for a lot of money. I need to fix that freaking bridge so I can get to the town and start like making some money. We only have $50. We've got some more money, we'll be laughing. Planks are on 60%. Do, 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 do. Yeah. I can't break the only workbench I have. I didn't mean to do that, I'm sorry. Trying to get rid of all these horrible, horrible fences that just look crap. Probably move this house eventually on top of the hill as well. Get rid of this little thing. Okay. Okay, okay. Copper ore and stone as well. Um, Let's put... Oh, I got some planks from that thing. Let's get rid of you. Pop those in there. Let's pop you in there. What else have I got space for? Get rid of those. Put copper ore in there. I wonder how I make a chest. Oh, is this done? Yes. So I've got the planks. Now I need duct tape. So how do I make duct tape? How many do I need? I need five. Duct tape. Confirm. Five duct tape. Put you away. You. You. Space in here for some nails. No, I don't. Oh, let me take. See how much of this stuff I can put in here. Do I have potatoes in there? I don't, but I do have carrots. Do 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 do. I feel like Hotbish would love this game as well. This is a Hotbish game for sure. And I need 15 stone. There we go. So now we can do. The bridge, I believe. Hello. 
I did. Here's all the materials. No, that doesn't make sense. Oh, I'm missing things. Oh, poor rope. It's doing something different. Oh, build a basic furnace. That's what I, I got the stuff for. I was looking at the wrong quest. I need four rope. What do I need to make rope? Rope. Four rope. What was the price of making a farm crop? Just dirt, isn't it? Uh, okay. Build these. Some more things down. Let's grab some wheat and some broccoli. I don't know how many seeds I need for an, an individual patch? Uh, no. Oh, six seeds. Okay. So I need six wheat and six broccoli. I'm gonna guess. Six are the same. Okay. Uh, inventory. Broccoli. Broccoli. Watering can. God, I can't see anything when it rains. I also need to sleep soon. Cool. Right, have everything. Let me do a sleep. Oh, oh, this is oh, this is what the home looks like. Okay. Gotta clean all this shit up. Six hours, sure thing. This is literally so adorable. Wake up. Off we go to see Tony. Do 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 do. Very quiet game. Did you find the materials? Yes, here's the materials. Awesome. I'll be able to speed up. Get some rest at home. I'm sure you can pull it. Uh, you can pull it off tomorrow. Okay, town bridge done. Collect lettuce seeds. Discover the origin. Visit Mumble Duck Rock and talk to the elder. Learning the basics. Build a furnace. Right. Let's do the furnace. What do we need for a furnace? We need. Is it gonna be you can get animals as well crazy furnace we have all the stuff Let's build a furnace yeah what we do in here we can put firewood iron ore firewood you need firewood for everything except for wedding rings you can make wedding rings so, let me eat some food Drink that. And then... I wonder how to clean the house. How do I clean this up? You can build here. I don't want to build, I want to clean. This shit's a mess. Okay, so we have to sleep till tomorrow. What time is it? Two in the morning. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Town bridge quest updated, so I'm assuming it's done. How do I know if these are ah, 33%, 12%? Um, do I have to get these to like 100% water? Need to stay watered. Do with some bottles of water, actually. I think I need to find a lake. 
hearts that I'm able to drink. Is your girl's thirsty? Hey, the bridge is done. New location discovered the bridge. Got all the seashells and stuff down there. Are we living for this game, Chris? I'm living. Probably. Follow the road on the left to Mulder Rock. If you go right, you will reach the lands of Glamorduck. What are these things? We've done these before. Resin. I need to find lettuce, apparently. Potato, beets. Oh, hello. John. Hey, hello. I don't remember you being here before, but my memory is not as good as it once was. What can a little old man like me do for you? Trying to get to know everyone. Just passing through. Uh... Just passing through, you know? I'm sure we all need some help from time to time. Maybe I could help you someday. Maybe you can help me. I'm John, by the way. I'm, how can I put it, someone that likes to live a simple life. I don't care too much about stuff. You can find me near my tent. I like walking down the beach and watching the ocean. Remember, you have spare coins sometimes. I'm always here. So you're a hobo who wants money from me. Understood. Gotcha. John steals money. Tony builds bridges. John steals money. Mumbleduck Rock, here we are. Hello, people, I'm new. What's this? The Elder's Home and Office. There we go. Is he gonna kill me for taking his flowers? Oh, I can't. Um, is he in here? Oh, he has like an aquarium. Such a shower? I don't know what that is. It's crazy. He said he might be in like the town square or something. Maybe here? A nice garden area. Look at this. Need one of these items in my hands oil or gas. Oh, I can take these flowers. Can I take these? I've got these ones yet. Give me all the flowers. Talk to the elder. Where's the elder at? Ooh, is this a shop? Hello. Trade. Oh, he's got... Oh, he's got empty bottles. He doesn't have a lot of anything else, though. You want to start buying some stuff? Need any more of these things that I already have? I just pick them up for the sake of it. Empty bottles. I'm assuming we can fill the empty bottles. Do you know where the elder is, sir? Uh... This place is huge. Ah, there's a little garden here. Do, 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 do. Uh, it's a hospital. I don't like that there's hospitals in this game. <laughs> what would they need one for? Hello, Alina. You lost. If you can find what's around here, you know those things. Da, da, da. Thank you. Getting used to town. Yeah. I'll make a machine to get out of here. Hmm, she's a robot maker. Lovely. Don't care who you are, you are, kid. Can I check, like, the map? Oh, yeah, map. How do I... Can I zoom in on anything? The elder's here somewhere. I just don't know where. Hey, Bam. Welcome back. That was just an absolute nightmare. I went to shop, not have a workout. Oh, God, is it busy? Busy and crazy. 
This is the bulletin where your friendly tannies make requests. Take the corresponding note if you are willing to help. Ah, this. Where the fuck is the Elder? Who is this geezer here? Diana, halt, who goes there? Who are you? Where did you come from? There's no need to fight, I just moved in. Uh, yeah. Once again, I hope you figure my hair down there. Town guard, okay. Uh, we aren't having many tourists lately. When someone appears out of the blue, they're generally up to no good. Well, I should get back to patrolling. It's a pleasure to meet you. Once again, I'm very sorry, blah, blah, blah. Lovely. Right, where is... Is that the elder? I see an old lady. I see an old lady. Tala. Talk to the elder. Here we go. Hello, my child. It's good to see a new face on our island. My name is Tala. I hope you like stories. I have so many of them to tell. I know how hard it is. Da, 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 da. Thank you, my name is Glamaduck. I'm still getting used to changes. It's good to know what that I can count on you. Yeah. It may look a bit chill here, but I always end up with some good stories to share, even at my age. So you finally came. Your parents talked to me so much about you a few years ago. Look at you now. I'm so proud. Uh, you know my parents and who I am? Oh, yes. Is it your first time on the island? But I'm afraid that... It is your first time on the island, but I'm afraid there is a lot for you to learn. I will explain, and I will begin by saying your parents are not really your parents. What the fuck? At least by birth, but we all know that the real parents are the ones who love and care for the children anyway. You were found on a beach called Blue Shell Beach, southwest of this town. Visit there when you have time, and in your belongings, which was not much, there was a bottle with a message inside and a note on the outside. This bottle here? Yes, that's the one. I remember very well that the note said the following. Learn the story of the world and the six elements. When you find the right place, you'll be able to open the bottle. At the time, the meaning of those words was clear to me, but later I need to study it all. You need to learn and read about the story of the world, and I had and I had with me years ago the three ancient books that could tell the story. But someone stole the books. Pirates. Okay, so I'm gonna have to fight some pirates at some point. Uh where can I find them? Uh, I think almost all islands have pirates. Three big ones. Pirate village with a pirate village on them. Uh, no more questions. Thank you. Cool. Uh, we have to build a marketplace and stuff. Lovely! Right, find the missing books. Active quests, farming basics, collect lettuce seeds, and then find the missing books. And the two things. The way they throw the stuff at you and when they scan it, snack it to me. Oh, I see what you mean. I don't know why Aldi, Aldi staff do that, because I feel like they get a kick out of it. They know full well the checkout area is tiny, and they just throw all of your items through as quick as possible. Makes me anxiety-ridden. Right, we're going home. Do -do 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 -do. Where can I get lettuce seed from? Guess I just have to... Collect each plant in the game. Oh, there we go. I guess they're just random. When you forage. That is seed done. Back we go. Do, 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 do. We're gonna go back to the garden, get ourselves some food, get ourselves some... I don't know what else we need. What else do we need? Food. We need to figure out how to get... how to make water. We need to find a lake that's near our house, I think. Happy Duck House. We have quite a lot of space, so I'm not gonna lie. They've given us a really big chunk of the island. I love it. Oh no, have these not grown? Um, there's nothing here yet? I think there's nothing here yet. I think I do need to keep water in though, I just feel like I have to for some reason. Oh. Nothing we can build in there. Small fish bait, wooden bucket. Ball. 
gift flowers. Uh, firewood, there we go. So from wood logs. So I need to get some trees cut down. That's what I need. My bag is full. Shit. Oh, that's what I want. How do I make more chests? How do I make some more chests? Um, farm decorations, shop, staff, vehicles, essentials, small chest, wooden plank and plant fiber. Wooden chest, iron ingots and rope. Oh fuck, to me to do that. How do I move them? How did I? They said you could move them, didn't they? This. Oh, you can rename your chest, that's good. Let's do this. Gives you all your stuff back, okay. Thank god I didn't waste anything. Let's get... There's gotta be a... A better way of... Sending all these things over than clicking them like this every time. Let's put seeds in here. Have a little seed... A little seed chest. Then we'll have like a little plant fiber and stuff chest. And all the extra like plant stuff. So like this can go in there. Flowers can go in there. Stuff like that. Oh, they have like a time frame on them. I think they spoil. Interesting. Didn't know that until now. Yeah. And then this one has... Let's take these. Let's take these, put all of these in here, put all of these. So do I have building materials and nails? Potato seeds. Hi Lauren, how are you? It's nice to see you darling. The worms and stuff in there as well. Right, I need to figure out how to get water, so... Ah, is this a little lake? I think it is. So if I grab these... Ah, there we go. Drink. Fill it up. That's nice and easy. Need to eat my apples and stuff. I get tired. What else can I make? I can make. I can buy myself flowers. I want to get my first like um, shop, office table, stall shop. Crafty one. Put up goods for sale and assign a staff member if one is available. Shops can be used to sell items to tourists. I don't want tourists here first though, you know? Oh, let's get some lights. Can I get some lights out here? Night candles. Need some rope. Some nice fences as well. We can make the house look really nice. Classic lampshades, special flags, special decorations. I want to get some... Let's just get some night candles. So we need rope and fat. We have plenty of fat. Let's make some rope. Some rope. Uh, what else do we need to do? Have I still got things in my chest. Need to go out. Not really. This one. This one. Take all of those. We can turn them into some planks. What else can I make? So how do I get these? 800 coins, no barn available. So I have to make a barn first. Okay. How do I make a barn? 
large big garage uh how do i make a barn hmm combat workbench special workstation ah oh, this makes weapons And it's basic stove, power generator. That's a lot of crap that I have to do. Solar panels, water pump. That could be handy. Allows pumping water into empty bottles, buckets, or watering cans. I need to get some, to get some iron for that. Cheese machine, wine machine, farm machine. How do I get a barn? No. Farm um, crop, trees. Oh, we can get some like mango trees and stuff. Oh, wait, here. Barn, there we go. 80 fine wood planks, 40 nails, and 15 glue requires 500, go 500 coins. So we need to make some stuff that we can sell, really. Decorations, where were we with them? What was I looking at? It was... Ah, night candles. There we go. Why can't I make any more? Oh they, oh, they cost money to make? 50 fucking hell. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Let's sleep till tomorrow. I wasn't expecting to pay 50 coins for them. Jesus. That was not where I wanted my money to go. Check one out. Imbecile. Imbecile! Wake up. Four in the morning, we still need to sleep. Let's sleep for four hours. Thank you. How are our crops doing? Ooh, look at our crops! Our broccolis are getting there, everything's getting there. 25%, 33%. Um, let's make some more... Let's make a shitload of glue. Where's my plant fiber and stuff? Need all of this. Plant fiber. Oh, I don't have any. Let's go foraging then, shall we? Some plant fiber. Make a shitload of glue. Make sh I just want to make a load of stuff so we have it all. Gimme, gimme. Blue. Whatever the max is, let's make that. That can take really long. Put you in there. The rest of it's all the seeds and stuff. Hopefully you can just like have as many as you want in a stack in here. That'd be really handy. I also don't, this is annoying me here, just like chilling in the middle. I need a key of some sort, but I don't know what key I need. Do some mining as well, because we're going to need some stuff for that. Some iron, some copper, that kind of thing. Do -do -do. We need to make some money. I'm wondering what we can make a stall of first. Maybe we make some, like, a shitload of like a, the biggest vegetable patch we can and just sell a load of vegetables maybe that's something we could do I'm trying to think what's going to be i don't know what's going to be good money yet because i've not we've not done it have we so we don't know what's going to be good money just yet uh, oh, vegetables are always good money in games like this though i find at the beginning anyway at least 
interested and curious to know if the like like these big rocks and stuff if they replenish or not or if i have to continuously like travel further afield that's kind of interesting i don't know what we're gonna need firewood we've got 20 iron 72 stone so we can make loads of brick we can make quite a bit of iron i just need some firewood first we can also make lots of copper ingots already just need this to hurry up. I'm wondering if I can make another workbench. What do I need for a workbench? Uh, oh, wait, can I can make one of these already? Special workstation. There we go. Maybe this works quicker. Grab this. Uh, you away, put you away for now. Put you away. I need to get some logs. Get some logs. I really want a pet as well. There's so many cute things here. I want a pet. I want a pet. I want my little shop, my little stall. I have to get a staff member apparently as well. I don't even think I can do it myself. I think I have to hire staff, just like in general. Just want to make a load of space over, over in this area. Get rid of some of these trees so we can make some more crops, crop areas. I hope we don't get like raided by pirates or anything like that. I hope that's not a thing. <laughs> Skill has improved foraging. Always the woodcutter. Woodcutter level 99 on RuneScape. First thing I ever did on every account. Twenty-five, sixty-six, thirty-three. I don't know if these need more water or not. They're like they look really dry. I don't think so. I really don't think. Ah, you do that G to move. Okay. Do I have any mail? Is that like a thing? Oh, I can move the house. Move the house up here. There we go. Make a little chest area. Move you down here now. Right, now we've got loads of space. Can I move this? Can't move this one, that's really annoying. So I can't move these until they've fully grown, can I? Right, what do I need for? It's just dirt, isn't it? So let's get some dirt. Make some more of these. I've got a bit of dirt left. It takes four to build one. Get a big garden going. We'll try and grow like one or two of everything, I guess, is probably a good shout. Need, yeah, they need watering because they've got nothing on them, that's why. Seems like a good idea, I agree. Just 
feel like having a big farm, it might like take... The only thing I'm concerned about is if I have a really big farm, like managing it and not letting things wilt or die or because I don't know how the game works just yet. So I'm a little bit weary that I might put a load of seeds down and end up wasting them because they've not grown. I'm not too sure. But you don't know until you try. And I also am just very set on the fact that I can almost guarantee that the money is going to come from things like crops in this sort of game, you know? Uh, da, 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 not you. Not you. Seeds. Seeds in there. Plant fiber. Dirt. Where did I put the worms? Oh shit, I've put them all in the wrong one. Maybe not having all these things so close together. Might be a little bit of a better idea. Put that there. Put that there. And then... Ropes as well. And now we've got these... Planks. Planks. I'm going to make firewood. Make firewood in there, and then for this one, what did I need? Oh, just firewood, wasn't it? Okay, so as the firewood's being made, that's good. So that means we can make something different in this one. Maybe we'll make fine wood planks. I need hardwood for that. Hardwood and resin. Glue. Exclusive multi-tool. Special tool that can be used to chop down trees and mine various rocks. That's interesting. Packs of nails. So we need iron ingots for that. So these will come when we get all the iron and stuff. Duct tape. Empty bottles. Camp kit. Easily prepare food and stuff. Okay, I don't need that just yet. Uh, what else can I get? Oh, we can buy like we can make fertilizer, things like that. I think I might. might I'm, I'm going to make a fishing rod. So I can fish. Don't make it too big yet, but one to two of each cop seems like a good start in my opinion. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Okay. Um, let's get the... Let's get the... Where's the... Where's my building one? This one, let's put you in here. And then I want to grab... Six of them. Something like that. Right, let's try this. Do I have any, do I have any more broccoli seeds? Did I grab those or not? I didn't. I've only got two. Just get the carrots. Just get everything out. Okay, so we've got one wheat there. So let's get... Where's my wheat? Some wheat there. Cauliflower... Some cauliflower here. I imagine you can hire staff for your farm, but it's just a guess, of course. Yeah, I imagine you can. It seems like there's a lot to do in this, quite frankly. Uh, I'm just going to put whatever I've got at the minute, to be honest. I'm not even going to put them in any fucking order or anything. Just whatever I've got. Did it say something about the seasons, then? Oh, only grows during spring. Spring, spring, spring. Every season except winter. Lovely.
Uh, gets like all of them. That's good. Right, we've got loads of crops growing. We have the crops growing. Uh, let's get some... I didn't mean to do that, but that'll do. Is it my machete that I'm supposed to use? Yeah, it is, isn't it? My machete works better. Or my knife, or whatever it is. Bag is full. I whack it all and then I'll come and collect it after I've dropped things off, you know? Get all of my goodies. Broccoli seeds, all sorts of stuff. Right, let's have a look at what's going on in these chests. This is all of my, like, this stuff. Dirt, fiber worms that I'm assuming we can eventually make into bait. This is all my building stuff that I've not got any of at the minute. This is my seeds. See, look, the wheat. It says wheat seed, type material, uh, misc, obviously, whatever, resistance, value, £10 a bag, I think, or maybe it's because of how many... No, yeah, £10 a bag. So I have $260 worth of wheat seeds. So if I sell these wheat seeds, because I can get loads anyway, and then maybe sell, like, the carrots as well. So if I sell... Oh, you have to keep it in there like that. If I sell these to somebody, we'll have enough money to make the thing that I want to make. Don't, remember, don't ask me what that was, I forgot. It's like... It was the barn. 500 coins we need for that. We need 80 fine wood planks, which I think I'm making now, and then we need the the nails and stuff. Oh, is this fine wood? Actually, I don't think it is. No, fine wood, I need to get hard wood. Where do I get hard wood from? I'm going to assume it's a certain type of tree, like the trees give you different things. Maybe? Let's try. That was wood log. Wood log. Or just like wood log. So how do I get hard wood? Do I have to make wood logs into hard wood, perhaps? Hard firewood from a wood log, wooden plank from a wood log, fine wood plank is hard wood, which looks the same thing, but it's not, plus resin. I wonder where I get it from. Do I have like an information thing about that? Foraging. Uh, can't click it. I can get your wood to hardwood. I'm very proud of myself for that sloppy boy. I wonder what I have to get it from. It must be something. I need to sleep anyway. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Sleep for 12 hours. Right, I'm just dipping to the loop.
but that fits me. Oh, this chair. Right, so let's go, and I want to know how to clean the inside of the house. There must be some way of doing that. Oh, look, the broccoli's grown. My bag is full. Oh, it just continues to grow. Oh, lovely. Oh, I got organic waste from that. Where's my broccoli? Just that there. Oh, there's six broccoli on the floor. Um. Anyways. Get the broccoli. There we go. We got six broccoli. So. Sells for 12 each, spoils in four days. Okay. Thank you. I haven't got any space in my bag for that. Beads, put these away. Okay, put the broccoli in the chest. Maybe it'll stay good in the chest. Like it won't spoil, possibly, I would hope. Like, if I'm growing all this veg, I'm gonna have to like sell it very quickly, aren't I? Okay, I have a shitload of firewood now. Make all of those. Uh, now I can make. I can add six. Make six iron ingots. Can I build? I just really want this. Oh, that's lamb and sheep. Oh, they're different. Oh. Calves and cows. Raise and take care of calves and cows here. Every barn can hold up to four animals. You can buy calves that will grow into cows from the farming menu. Make sure to prepare a good space in front of the barn by planting some grass. Lambs and sheep is the same thing. Oh, it's exactly the same thing. So it's a hundred dollars less to get lamb and lambs and sheep. Is there like a chicken pen? Chicken coop. There, chicken coop. Five hundred. Fine. I still need fine wood planks though. I don't know how to get this hardwood. Get hardwood. Milking station. Greenhouse. 8,000 for that. There we go, make that. Do, 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 do. I think I can get like, let's, should we get calves, calves and cows? They require the same thing. I just need to find out how to get this hard, this, these planks. All right, let's take what we've got to the shop. Well, to, the, to see if we can trade with somebody. Let's see if they want what we've got to sell, <clears throat> which is our seeds. I'm going to assume we have to be in town for it. So I'm going to head on over there. Do, 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 do. do, 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 do. Do 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 do. Hope your seed isn't the cheap seed. 
Oh, can I not attack things in this town? Ow. Okay. Maybe not. I think I can get these trees. No. I just want to know... Oh, she's the lookout, isn't she? There must be some other market stalls as well, not like just the one, you know? The one that I saw. There's got to be more than one. I've just got to find it. Central Park, where all major events take place. Oh, this does not look like the right way. Oh, is this a different person today? Oh, wow, okay. Oh, they don't sell for as much as you, as you want when you get here. They sell for a little bit less. That's fine. It's still a lot more money than I was expecting. We'll keep that. Sell you them. Oh, he has avocado seeds! They're so expensive. Oh my god, they're so expensive. Avocados. What is that? Fig? Banana? Coffee? Cassava? Okay, thank you for your time, sir, but I want... Jordan's shop open in the morning and closed for the rest of the day. Well, that's not very good, is it? There's gotta be more shops. There has to be. Who's this? Hello. Okay, he sells stone, iron ore, and copper. It's not that expensive, actually, but it'd be way more expensive than it is. Orange must. Gotta be more shops. Like, is there a farming person here who sells farming stuff maybe at some point in the day? Possibly. Or maybe allows you to use the garden. What's this? What is house? Should I just try and go in one of these houses? There's never put anybody oh that's a school, I think. Who's this geezer? Samwell. Uh, hi, nice to meet you. Oh, he's the library person, okay. Okay. It's gonna be more than one shop. Unless that's like, the shops are diff- Oh, there's things on here now, look. Need a few more items for my workshop. I need one silver ore, an iron bucket, and a pack of screws. Can you find these things? No, I can't. Been super busy building a new computer. I need some two electrical wires. No, I can't do that either. I don't, don't think I can make any of this stuff yet. I need like... Let me cook, you know? Like, let me cook. Also, where the fuck do I get hardwood? Would somebody Google where I get hardwood from? I would be really appreciative. It might just be on a different island. Not island. Well, maybe a different island. Or maybe just like a different part of this island. I haven't been to yet. I'm assuming it's like a different style of tree, you know? Do, 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 do. Hmm? Hmm? Alright, 
right, this is all done. This is all done. Level up and reputation boost. Okay, make that. Now we can make pack of nails, packs of screws. Make 20 of them. Packs of screws. 10 of them. Just get some stuff being crafted so we've got bits and bobs, you know? Uh, B. Chicken coop. Fine wood planks. One stall shop. It's crafting work contracts for hiring staff. Once you make one, equip it in a quick slot, then interact with a tourist to hire them. Simple staff house. Small garage. It's gonna be so good when we can go around on this stuff. DLC stuff like that, but it looks so it's so, it looks so intriguing. Um, I mean, until we figure out how until we figure out how to make these things, I don't think I'm going to be able to make much else. Interesting. All that now. Yeah, we can't. We haven't got the levels to do much of this yet, which is fine. I really want this though. I really do want this. Pack. I need twenty. I need more nails, so I need to do some mining. Do you know what? I might leave it here for today. I'm gonna leave it here for today. I th I'm definitely gonna continue playing this. I don't honestly. I don't know whether I want to do Skyrim or this more at the minute. I don't know which one I'm gonna enjoy the most. Hi, Pyro. How are you, darling? It's nice to see you. Have you been up? What have you been up to? How have you been? You've literally just caught me at like the worst time. I'm, I'm about to head off, but I'll be back tomorrow. I think I'm gonna leave it here for today. I'm probably gonna have a little play around with this tonight and see if I can figure out how to get all the things that we need to start like actually having a lot of fun on this game because it seems like there's quite a few things that you actually need to do um, before you can get to starting like your own little shops and things like that um, but yeah I'll do, I'll do a little bit of research tonight a little play around on it and then I don't know I might come back and play this tomorrow for a bit I might do Skyrim who knows right I love you all. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. If you want to chill in Discord after, just let me know. I'll be in there anyway. If not, have a wonderful rest of your evening. And I shall see you all tomorrow. Goodbye!